Hey guys, welcome once again to One Coin Only. Oh my gosh, I need to clear my throat. <clears throat> I think I've got a case of the My Sharona. Hang on. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. There you go. What a, what a professional host I am. And uh, oh my gosh, there's already stars coming. All right, guys, thank you so much. Marco, Nick with the stars, you guys are awesome. This has gone out to you. My gosh, the chat is flying. Sorry, guys, I can't keep up right now. <laughs> Nick and Marco, thank you so much. Guys, welcome once again to One Coin Only. I've just woken up pretty much pretty recently, but that doesn't matter because I'll be fully wide awake very, very soon because I'm going to have the nemesis chasing after me all bloody day. Uh, we're actually going to attempt to finish the Resident Evil 3 remake today. We got over halfway through yesterday, and uh, I think today we can, uh, or earlier today, I should say, and I think today we can make it happen. So, uh, yeah, we got up to the hospital. So that's where we got up to last night before I went to bed. We're going to start again from scratch uh, as an encore presentation. And hopefully we can beat this whole thing uh, working together, guys. So don't be shy to help me uh, solve the puzzles and everything. Big thank you to coming. Guys, you have to forgive me. The comments are gone mental. I, I can't do the individual hellos today. But thank you so much for coming in. I just want to thank everyone else for the kind stars. We got Matt. Uh, we got Lamont, we got Josh, we got Veronica with the very generous stars. This one's going out to you guys. Thank you so much for the love. And this one. <laughs> Thank you, everybody. Honestly, already got six lots of stars already. Thank you for supporting. Guys, the main thing is I hope you guys all enjoy the stream today. Uh, my first impressions of this game, this game is absolutely brilliant. Um, yeah, man. I, I, I kind of like we're going to do assisted mode today. I kind of like... I, I kind of feel compared to Resident Evil 2 Remake. Now, both are fantastic, but this one is a bit more fast-paced and a lot more linear. Not as much backtracking, at least initially. And um, I, I kind of like that. The pacing, at least until the hospital, is fantastic. So, uh, yeah. Hey, go on, Alcus. Good to see you. Andy, good to see you there. Maddie, good to see you. Billy, Ian, thank you for the 50 stars. Good fuckity day. <laughs> thank you, Ian. I'll be right with you, my man. Oh, Billy says he finally joined the movement and became a supporter. Billy, thank you so much. Billy, don't forget to drop us uh, a retro request for whatever Wednesday in our inbox, hey? Thank you so much, Billy. Commitment, honesty, integrity. Ian, I'll get, I'll get to you as soon as the cutscene is over, my man. Thank you so much. <clears throat> Drew says, go kill Nemesis, dude. I hope so. Josh, drop in the 50 stars. Joshy, thank you so much. It's this foundation. Cat's gonna go to Sonoris. Cat, we'll see you next time. Brighter future for all of us. I like that they actually use movie footage in this too. Oh gosh. Yeah, the nemesis in this is really, really scary. What I like is this game is just intense from the get go. You know how in the original, it's a while before you meet Menace and Nemesis? In this one, he's just on you straight from the beginning. It's, like, really crazy. How you going, Alex? Good to see you. Oh, my gosh. Oh, boy. There you go. Yeah, Cat, we hope you have a lovely sleep. So Steven says you're going to get this from the store because you don't have the internet right now. Oh, that's a bummer. Hopefully there'll be something open for you. Hey, go on, Johnny. Good to see you. Oh, here she is. The very sexy Jill is getting out of bed. And uh, all right, so we got a big shout out to both Josh and to Ian for the stars. Thank you so much, guys. This is for you. Thank you, everybody. How you going, Matthew? Good to see you there. Alright, here we go. So we got Jill. And it looks like Jill's gotten up in the, in the middle of the night. It's raining outside. There we go. We're going to shut the window. We don't need to get the whole house wet. And you probably shouldn't leave the window open. Someone could just, like, climb in. And that's pretty stupid, actually. I mean, I know you're a total badass, Jill. But you should really lock your doors and windows, my friend. It's not 1936 anymore when people just don't go and ransack homes. Anyway... 
We're gonna we're gonna look at this mirror. Watch that sexy face of yours. JK, if, if I can find the screen, absolutely. JK, thank you very much for the $5 super chat. Guys, it's a little bit hard to request specific screens sometimes just because I've got so many here. But I, I found it. I'm going to do my best. Thank you so much, JK Software. Lamont, yeah, we're playing from the beginning. This is. I, I wanted to do an encore for the people that couldn't watch in the morning. Jason with 100 stars, but we're going to try and play through the whole thing this time. Josh chopping the 100 stars. Thank you, Josh. How you going, Kevin? See you later, Jill Sandwich. <laughs> Ian thinks Resident Evil weird look. Resident Evil looks weird in first person. I don't know, man. <clears throat> oh, here we go. So this one's going out to Jake. Thank Jake and Jason with the stars and the super chat. Thank you so much, guys. Draw. Draw. There you go. Snake Pliskin. <laughs> Appreciate you guys. Thank you so much for looking out for one coin today. As I said, guys, don't forget, copy and paste today is your best friend. But uh, I'm going to be doing my best to, to keep up with the chat as much as possible. All right, here we go. So we're going to have to go to the bathroom over here. Let me open this sunbish door. All right, here we go. I guess this is deja vu. I guess Jill needs to wash her face again. I, I guess the poor girl's been through a lot. She's getting those night terrors, huh? <clears throat> Cedric dropping the $5 super chat. Cedric says you sound tired, my man. Well, Cedric, I've been working a bloody lot lately, but I'm not complaining or anything. I just can't do much about it. You know what I mean? I don't have an off button. I mean, <laughs> I, know, I, know, I know I've got bags under my eyes, and I know I'm not 100% awake, but I am doing my best. Cedric, thank you for the $5 super chat. This one's going out to you. How you going, Sean? Good to see you. Alright, here we go. I'm try I'm doing my best to do a complete run. I don't I think we can do it. As I said, we got very close last night before bedtime, so let's pick up the Sunbish phone over here. Hello? Jill! Are you, are you okay? Brad, is that you? Listen, you gotta get out of there. What are you talking about? I don't have time to explain. You gotta get out of there right now. Alright, let me grab my ah! Oh shit, the nemesis is broken in my house. Okay, well, you know what? I guess we ain't gonna be living here no more. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I, I forgot he breaks into your house, actually. Yeah, uh, Jill, I don't think I don't think a handgun's gonna cut the mustard right now, sweetheart. Look at this son bitch. I told you he's a stage five clinger. Fuck it, he's gonna do the Roman Reigns one in a sec where he punches the ground. Oh my shit, yeah, Jill, Jill, get the fuck out of there, Jill! Jill, get out of there! Kevin says, how'd the Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen game go? It, it went. <laughs> Guys, I think I've got like uh, another 200 stars from Michael. Michael, thank you. No, that's okay, Mikey. You enjoy, brother. We'll see you afterwards. We can maybe do this again, again later on together. Mikey, this is for you before you go. Thank you very much for the kindness. As I said, guys, if I miss anything, let me know. I don't mean to be rude on purpose. Uh, is it trying trying to find ammo or something? Just double checking. I haven't missed anything. We just, we just man, this whoever lives in this house likes to drink a lot of beer. All right, we need to go out of here. What the hell? Oh gosh. <laughs> Why wouldn't that break a few, if not just one rib? You would think so, wouldn't you? How do we get out of here? Hang on. Wait, is there another window? Oh, okay, we're going to go in this building. Don't mind me, guys. I'm not really paying a whole lot of attention. Fuck it, hey! Oh, my gosh. Chris, how are you going? Yeah, Chris, I banned. Dude, I was... Bro, I... I, I, I... 
I was wor I haven't had a chance yet, Chris, because I was working all night last night. And I only I, I I woke up and got straight back into streaming. But yes, I dude. Oh my gosh. I will, Chris. I will, man. I, I man. Sometimes I wish there was two of me. <clears throat> Thank you, Josh. Dropping the hundred stars. Bill with the hundred stars. Kid Jackson with 178 stars. Guys, thank you very, very, very much. Well, what do we got? So we got... Man, Josh dropping... Oh, my God. Guys, thank you. Okay, so we got Josh with 200. We got Bill with 100. And Kid Jackson with 178. You awesome son of bitches. This is going out to you. Marco also dropping the 100. Here you go, Marco. Thank you, guys. Josh dropped Wow, it's a star shower. Taylor's commenting here. This is for you. Oh, my gosh. Kid Jackson with 100. <laughs> oh, Josh with another 100. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> Oh, you guys are crazy. Thank you very much, guys. Much love, hey, seriously. Man, I, I hope I got everyone. That was just crazy. Oh, crap. Now we're in this burning house again. Barkity. Bill, oh, my God. Bill dropping another 100. Kid Jackson with another 100. Chris, I've just, I just worked all night last night and woke up and got straight back into streaming, so I haven't had a chance to get back to emails yet, bro. I, I, I just said, Chris, sometimes I wish there was two of me, man. I've just... <laughs> oh. oh my gosh, this is going nuts. <clears throat> Oh, oh, what do we got here? What the hell? I know, right? So can we can we pause here so I can give a big thank you to everybody again? Cedric says he believes in me that I could beat this game today. JK Software with two dollars super chat. Thank you guys. Marco with a hundred. Nick with fifty. Josh with a hundred. Matt with fifty. Josh with fifty as well. Guys, you're amazing. Amazing. <laughs> Thank you, guys. That's incredible. Man, I'm sorry. I wish I... Man, that's a bit, man, I can't believe it. As I said, it's like Haley's comment in here. I wish I could just... Uh... Man, you, you, you guys have been so incredible that if I did an individual star screen for everyone, it'd be an hour before we even started the game. Oh, my gosh. They're still coming in. Just look around you. The longer we wait, the more screwed we are. Hey, going, Enrique. Nice to see you. We've got Louie in here. Kept oh. oh gosh, thank you so much. Captain BS has just dropped a twenty dollars super chat, and uh, L L A Evans has just dropped uh, fifty stars. Guys, you're incredible. You don't need to send me so many stars, guys. Just chill out and enjoy the game, honestly. Captain BS, thank you so much. That is massive. And L A Evans, this is for you too. When everybody knows your name. So Everyone knows what my name is. It's some bish. Timmy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Timmy also dropping the $2 super chat. Can't Timmy. Thank you, my man. Can't touch this. Bro, we haven't had such a crazy chaotic shower in this in such a long freaking time. This is nuts. You guys are awesome, honestly. Marco says, Marco says, must send stars, Mar Oh my gosh. Marco, this is for you. Everyone's trying to hijack the stream. Yeah, guys, we might need to spread them out a little bit. This one's going out to you, Cedric. Cedric with the $5 super chat. Lamont also with the 50 stars. Freak show. You're going nowhere. I got you for three minutes. Three minutes of heat time. 
Oh my god. Yeah, we might. I never thought in a million years I'd say this, but we might need to spread them out, guys. Otherwise, people are going to leave if we're not playing the stream. <laughs> you guys are amazing. Thank you so much. You, my sister's fine. Thank you, Timmy. You guys are incredible. Thank you for all the love. <clears throat> How you going, Daniel? Good to see you there. So yeah, for those of you who've just come in, now that I've got my bearings back, um, I've got, uh, this is the full version, guys, so this is not the demo, this is the actual game. Okay, looks like we're straight in here. Alright, come in you go, Brad. <laughs> right back at you, Marco. Now it's become a star, a star shower to a star hijacking. I know this stream has been held hostage. <laughs> the dark bar bard says it's too bad it's not beat it or eat it. Like yeah, the old format, right? And here we go. Ian says all aboard the Sunbish Star Train. Ian, thank you very much for the 50 stars. Sorry guys, I'm just gonna have to hold off the screens for a little minute. <laughs> Thank you, Ian. I really appreciate the 50 stars. Now yeah, Josh says, oh shit, you wanted to play tonight. So uh, we just gonna shoot him in the head, I guess. Alright. Oh, he's dead. Man, that was a great shot. Right between the eyes, some bish. Alright, in we shall go. <clears throat> You miss the old Beat It or Eat It shows? I think for next season of Beat It or Eat It, um, the format's going to be a mixture of the old and the new. So, uh, yeah, for next season of Beat It or Eat It, I think we'll go back to um, doing a mixture of the wheel and a, a single game, depending on the episode. And uh, so Tommy says, you're hearing rumors that Prime is coming back to WWE. And also, there's a new cane coming. Just, but really, that would be interesting. I've not heard that. Wow, a new cane, like the fake cane, hey? That that'd be interesting. All right, well, we're not gonna we're not gonna worry about that old bastard right now. Go to the rooftop parking lot. All right, we can do that. Hey, go, Mr. Drew. Good to see you. Is this so? Yeah, Marco says this is a star screen only stream. <laughs> How you going, Vanessa? Lovely to see you. I feel like we haven't had a chat much lately, Vanessa. I hope you're doing well. Alright, so we're going to get to the roof. There's someone said just uh, earlier today when we were playing this that if it was me, uh, I would not be going in the elevator. I, t I totally see your point in that. Oh, get off me, dick face. Yeah, don't you be biting Jill. Only I'm allowed to put my hands on Jill. Okay, that was a little bit creepy, wasn't it? Anyway, let's just get out of here, Jill. Get out of here, Jill, before you become a sandwich! Alright, we got this. Come on. Can I turn the volume up a little bit? Yeah, guys, absolutely. Let me know how that is. I bumped it up just a tiny bit. That was you, Lamont. Yes. <laughs> uh, and I know you guys had some pretty, pretty pretty good calls last night actually now don't forget the best way to help out the stream is 100% for free guys just give us a big thumbs up if you don't mind everybody there's no way you get in, in, in an elevator in apocalypse yeah there we go we're on the roof no fucking A oh well that didn't work out for us did it I don't remember prime time I remember crime time you know, Chad and, uh, Chad and JPG. I mean, Shad and JPG, sorry. sorry. Uh. Alright, we're going to run over Nemi now. There you go, we're going to run over Nemi. And then it's going to be game over, the end. Start the car, Jill! What the hell is wrong with you? It's like you've never started a freaking car before. It's yeah, it's my turn. Let's go, Nemi. Here we go, Nemi. Here we go. Uh, uh. Fuck it, hey, no! Nemi, get off me! Yeah! You are the weakest link. Goodbye! 
And see, this is a bit like last night where I said uh, Jill must do the DDP yoga. Because she looked, she just crashed off like three stories in that car. And she just bent over in all sorts of directions. And uh, yeah, like I said uh, earlier today, I think DDP yoga just saved Jill's life there. So uh, that's, that's why DDP's my hero. <laughs> How you going, Jerry? Good to see you. Hey, go on, Steven. Thank you for coming in. Oh my gosh, all right. Hey, fuck this. How is she not dead? What was what, what Carlos here now already? Oh, this guy, he's a total badass. Way to go, Carlos. Way to go. Uh, uh. Look at him being all white knight saving the day. Who are you? What are you doing? It's Carlos. And I'm saving you. Come on. Let's get you someplace safe. Lamont said, how's she not dead? Because she's she's Jill. <laughs> oh, prime time was Percy Watson. I remember Percy Watson. He was entertaining as fudge. So who did Percy Watson tag up with? I remember him on commentary, not as much as a wrestler apart from the old NXT. I think we're in the clear. I hope so. We've been bringing survivors here. Here where? My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. It's safe. I'm fine. Personal space. Okay. There you go. I don't. You mean yeah? Personal space, bro. But you know, I don't blame you, Carlos, for trying. But yeah, you barely know each other. Give the poor girl some personal space. You know, maybe later on. <laughs> James with a hundred stars. James, thank you so much, my man. James, this one's going out to you. Thank you very much, bud. Thank you for giving me a chance just to get my eye in, guys. The good news is I got onto the stream feeling very sleepy, but after that nemesis encounter, I'm feeling very awake already. You think Carlos sounds a little bit like Roman Reigns? You know what we're going to have to do? You know what you should do, Lauren? You should pull up IMDB and type in Resident Evil 3 and find out who the voice cast is. You should pull it up. Joshy dropping the 50 stars too. Thank you, Josh. Oh my gosh, Steve, that's massive. Steve just dropped 2,000 as well. Steve says, Rick, I love it when you play new games like this to give you a chance to see if you want to pick it up yourself. That is really, really kind of you, Steve. Thank you very much. That's way too many zeros, sir. Appreciate it. Steve dropping a big 2,000 stars. Kid Jackson also with 1,000. Marcel also with 1,000. Marcel asked me if I'm watching Mania this weekend. Yes, I'm going to be doing wrestling streams this weekend for WrestleMania as well. So this one's going out to all you awesome sumbishes. Brian, I thought primetime players was per Percy Watson and Titus O'Neil. The mega, yeah, the mega, yeah, the mega power, yeah. Mega power, yeah. You guys are incredible, honestly. That's way too much. Thank you, guys. Appreciate that. You're spoiling me, as I said. You're spoiling me like, uh, uh what's his name? Silvio's favorite stripper at happy hour at the Butter Bing. Oh, look, that's Candy over there. She's most popular at 8 p.m. for all the boys. Like, you know... Like that kind of business. I don't know if that was a good analogy or not. I'm probably going to get myself in trouble. But hey, if it was raining anymore in here right now, guys, I'd have to take my clothes off and start dancing at the Butter Bing. Nice to meet you, Jill. <laughs> I am UBCS, platoon leader Mikhail Viktor. My team was sent here to rescue civilians. Kid Jackson with another 100 stars, my man. Thank you so much. How's that going <clears throat> for you? This city is Jack says this is out already. I got this game a little bit early because I live in Australia and I'm 16 uh, hours ahead. So that, that's why I get to play it a little bit early. My platoon has suffered serious James losses. also dropping 100 stars. How you going there, Jonathan? And, and, and Jerry says, for the love of God, Rick, please don't start pole dancing. Are you trying to tell me, Jerry, that I'm not sexy? Are you trying to tell me that I'm not sexy? 
and evacuate some survivors. Yeah, I remember that, Tim Adams. Abraham Washington uh, got in trouble for cracking a, a, a Kobe Bryant uh, certain uh, joke about Kobe Bryant that was pretty distasteful, I think. I think that's why Abraham Washington got uh, fired. And probably rightly so, because ever since he got fired, Abraham Washington's done nothing but slam uh, WWE. Josh says Stone Cold or The Rock. Ah, oh, man, I really, really like both, but if I had to pick one, I'd probably pick Stone Cold. So, Joshy with the 50, James with the 100, and Kid Jackson with the 100. Thank you so much, guys. This is for you. Speaking of wrestling... <laughs> Thank you, homies. Nothing that I will miss. So Heather said, no, Heather, just, you know, Heather, honestly, you just chill out and you enjoy the stream. And, uh, Kid Jackson dropping it like it's hot, man. Oh my gosh, you're, you're the, you're the definition, Kid Jackson, of what Snoop Dogg and Pharrell were, uh, singing about. I never understood what that drop it like it's hot song meant until I got so many stars. Kid Jackson, thank you. Josh, also with the 50. Um, Heather, the best way you can help us out is by liking the stream and just relaxing and having fun, honestly. Don't, don't you even worry about it. Now, don't forget, we don't need to read all the articles unless you've got the green highlighted text because they're important clues. But uh, I think we're good to go here for a second. This one's gone out to Kid Jackson and Josh. Back online. Rutherford that. just asked me before, do I think Rhea Ripley's going to lose against Charlotte? I originally thought that uh, Rhea Ripley was going to beat uh, Charlotte Flair. But now that we're in empty arena matches, the dynamic's a little bit different. So I I'm not really sure, to be honest. It's, it's a hard one to answer. We have to, we have to make some uh, sunbish bullets here. We have to make as much space as we can in the early going because we're going to be picking up a lot of stuffs. Open that box. Oh, there you go. We got a red hope. Damn. I okay, it's all right. Is there more bullets here? Hang on. Uh, just looking around here. We need to find a couple crystals there. Okay, well, we could put some things away. So uh, we're going to put that away. We're gonna put that away. We're gonna put that away. We don't need any of that for now. And there we go. We're gonna do our first save. Lamont says you got Darkwing Duck queued up. Absolutely, I do, Lamont. Lamont, thank you for the 50 stars. This one's for you. And so Lauren says this looks so much like Resident Evil 2 remake. Uh, what you need, guys need to realize, uh, this game is made on what's called the Resident Evil engine. So this is going to, all the Resident Evil games for the time being are going to look very, very similar. Because they've now got a Resident Evil engine. And that's actually good news. So, you know, while it, the games are going to look very similar, at least now that there's a Resident Evil engine, uh, you guys are going to be able to get Resident Evil games a lot quicker now. Because the engine's just readily available. They're not building every game from scratch. So, it's kind of advantageous, to be honest. You could probably see a new Resident Evil game every year or every two years. Now that there's an engine, you know what I mean? So, um, I think it's more of a positive thing than a negative thing myself, personally. So, we just got to work out where we got to go first. I, I guess we'll start from... Oh, crap. I'm just trying to see if I've missed any... No. I guess the only way I can go right now is over here. <clears throat> Lauren says, this game looks good regardless. I think so. Yeah, I, well, that's what I think. I think now that we've got a Resident Evil engine, I think uh, a Code Veronica remake is... I'd, I'd be willing to bet on it, actually. Barkadoo, excuse me. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I'd be willing to bet on it. My gosh, they're crazy. Oh, we got him. Josh says this looks great. I think so. So, once I get in that tunnel, please don't forget about the bugs that I make you see. Yeah, bro, there's this tunnel. 
where we need to turn on all these electrical uh, power breakers a little bit later. And there are these bugs that if they catch you, they give you parasites. It's like really, really disturbing actually. So yeah, we, we got to avoid them at all costs. Um, what have we got over here? We're just going to break open this box very quickly. Hey, go on, Evan. Good to see you. Thank you for coming in. Alright, so, uh, alright. <clears throat> Kevin says, do you think they'll use this engine for other games? Man, I think you're going to get at least another three or four games out of this engine, 100%. You mean the alley that's on fire? Jonathan says, did I complete the game when I played earlier? I, um, I got about two-thirds in, and then I went to bed. I didn't go to bed because I got stuck as much as I went to bed because I just needed to sleep. Um, because I was always intending on coming back and doing an encore screening now. But obviously you need to get enough rest. But yeah, no, I no, we got about two thirds in, in the in early in the morning stream. We we got up to the hospital, if you remember Resident Evil 3. But uh one one thing with this game is the different locations you go in are in a slightly different order. So it's not as exactly the same as the original. Um, Alright, let's, let's have a look down here. I'm trying to save as many bullets as I can for now. Uh, which way should we go first? Should we go in here first? I guess we can. <clears throat> oh, you mean other than Resident Evil games? Uh, I, I don't think so, Kevin. But I mean, it's not out of the realm of possibility. <laughs> I didn't get much sleep, guys. But Nemesis woke me up this morning in a hurry. Oh, there's a safe here. I've already got the code. So it's a uh, nine, three, seven. Oh shit, I screwed it up. Sorry guys. I wrote this down last night. Nine, fuck it, I keep doing the wrong button. Fuck it, nine, three, seven. There we go. So what's in this bad boy? I kept my notes, guys. So we got like the red dot sight for this handgun now, which is like. Totally badass. There we go. You don't see why not it looks so damn good? Joel Lauren says, who's my nemesis? Man, you're asking the deep questions right now, bro. I don't know, Lauren. I just work here. <laughs> there we go. We got some gum powder. What's this bad boy? So, Captain BS, I think this game... Uh, takes place before the events of Resident Evil 2 and part of it takes place after it, doesn't it? You, you, see, you see events before Resident Evil 2 in this game, that much I know. Like the police station and everything. Uh, okay, we gotta... Go in here, I guess. Alright, all right, so far so good. So, the word on the screen... Street is that Dino Crisis remake was scrapped. I mean, they could totally make a Dino Crisis reboot on the Resident Evil engine. I mean, that would be perfect. I think it needs a reboot. I, 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 I couldn't get into the first Dino Crisis because I thought it was way too focused on puzzles more than the action. It just really pissed me off, to be honest. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! She just jumped back at me. Piss off, you stupid zombie mother bitch! Oh my gosh, I'm gonna... Damn it, there's too much going on over here, guys. Fuck it, excuse me. Oh, man. Got you, some bis. Oh, we got him. All done, all sorted. <laughs> Hey, Curtis says, thank you for playing Rygar. Man, you're going to have to help me out with that game one day, Curtis. Because I, I don't know how to play Rygar to save myself. Seriously. I have to go back over here. My bad. I, th I think Claire might need a, a health th a thingy in a sec. There we go. We need more gunpowder. There you go. Making as much space in this inventory as we can. Oh, there's another fucking zombie. Yeah, how do you like that one, sister? Oh, my gosh. I didn't hear we go. Let's keep looking around. There you go, more gunpowder. You can never have enough gunpowder, seriously. 
looking around very carefully for everything. Yeah, man, there's plenty. Oh. So we need to come back in here later with the lockpick. I can't remember where we find the lockpick. I may, maybe it's in this box actually. Let's have a look. No, no, it's not in here actually. We haven't got it yet. So let's see what's in this bad boy. And uh, hey, going Johnny. Good to see you. Thank you for coming in. I hope you're having a great day. Okay, so that's we're back at the subway station to put in that little thing. So can we put anything away yet? Um, yeah, we... No, actually, I'm going to leave everything out. I don't think we need to put anything away for now. Alright. <clears throat> Justin dropping the 200 stars. Justin, thank you so much for the support, man. Appreciate that. Justin, this is for you. Oh, thank you, Curtis. Hey, go on, Gavin. Good to see you. So, as I said, uh, this playthrough today, guys, is a full game attempt. Um, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna use a lot of resilience today. If I get stuck at puzzles, I don't care. I'm gonna push really hard and and do and do my best to get ish done. I don't want to go out that door yet. We we gotta look for some stuff out here quickly first. Just gonna quickly exploring uh, this area. Hang on. So how do we go through here? Uh, there's like a, a chain we need to cut later on. That's fine. So that's for later. Uh, let's see what's over here. So this is this is all done essentially. Okay, so we do need to go through the donut shop. Hmm. <laughs> all right. Roger dropping the fifty stars. Thank you so much, Roger. I am not lost. I am just. Making sure I'm covering everything. Alright, here we go. New area. So now where are we going to go? Down this way, I guess? No, we can't go down there yet. Oh, what's this? Some more gunpowder. Alright, all great. Oh, boy. Man, lucky I'm a good shot. Alright, gosh. Alright, we got him. So let's see where we're going to go now. I'm just trying to... Man, I feel like I'm missing something really, really obvious here. No, I... Oh my gosh, guys. Sorry, I've got... Oh my goodness. I need to find the bolt cutters from somewhere. Yes. I haven't been... Roger dropping the 50 stars. Dan, thank you so much. He just bought this for his daughter. Do I think it's necessary that you play Resident Evil Remake first? It's not necessary, but it'd be good because it follows on, you know? Dan, this is for you. Roger, thank you very much for the 50 stars as well. Oh, no worries, Curtis. You're going to know that the first question I'm going to ask is what did you do? Oh my gosh, piss off, zombies! Sorry guys, I'm just, uh, I'm getting a little bit flustered here just because I'm focusing on a lot of things. So let me just, uh, re oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, thank you guys, the support's been amazing. My multitasking skills just isn't all that fantastic today. Alright, so what do we got? So we can't go in here yet, that's got a, a, a bolt cutter. So where's the bolt cutters at? Maybe I need to go up in this door, I, th I don't think I've been in here yet. I think this is the door that I haven't been in yet. Oh, here we go. So this is a new room. All right, good. We got this. Patrick, that is amazing and a lot of zero, sir. Patty, thank you so much for looking out. It's going out to Patty for the big 1,000 stars. I do indeed, Kyle. So, what would you little maniacs like to do first? <laughs> Patrick, that is amazing. Thank you for looking out, my man. We're going to... Uh, all right, here we go. I think this is the room I needed to go in. I, it was just one room that I, I wasn't paying attention. It's all right, guys. We got this now. This so we need to way come way. here and control this subway thing later on. Uh, but we've got to turn the power back on in here first, which is... 
Oh, we can't open that yet without a lock pick. All right. Um, simple lock, control panel. All right, that's all for later. There's still another door that we haven't been in in here, so we're not lost yet. Let's see what's in this. Oh, look, there we go, the fire hose. Fantastic. That's going to take us to the next part of the map. Oh, good in the in the hood. So I think I think that what we got. We need to come back in here for the shotgun later on. And let's see what's in these little. Hopefully we'll find a backpack soon, guys. We need we need some like more space. Um. Hopefully we. I think the bolt cutters are in the next area of the game anyway. So we're gonna come back in here and get that shotgun. So uh, whatever happens, guys, don't let me forget. And, uh, you think maybe they'll remake Umbrella Chronicles? I wish, but I very much doubt it. If, if I wanted, if I got another Umbrella Chronicles, I'd want to play it with the Zappa. Alright, so what we need to do is we need to go all the way back to this side, where the Fire Hydrant is. Which is not that complicated, we actually just need to run back through the donut shop. Are you talking to me? You can't be talking about me, uh, Trisha. I'm just a sumbish. <laughs> I'm just, I, I'm just an absolute sumbish. But I thank you for the love if that was going out to me. <clears throat> what do you guys think about this game on first impressions? I think they did a, a really nice uh, redesign of Raccoon City in this. It definitely looks apart, doesn't it? Well, there we are. So we're gonna use this. Uh, Pose here, pretty a lot more straightforward to use this than it is in the original. I am loving my gun games. I'm going to be doing the GoldenEye gun game for you. I'm going to be doing the Call of Duty gun game for you. I'm going to be doing the Dead Space gun game for you. We we ain't got no shortage of content right now. Oh, right, here we go, new area, and we finally got this. Part of me wants to go back right now and get that shotgun, but. Yeah, you know, we should probably go back and get the shotgun. As much of a pain as what it is. Maybe we should get that out. Should we go back and get the shotgun, or do you think we should wait? Nah, you know what, guys? I think we should go back and get that shotgun. I know it's a pain. But, um... No, we're, we're gonna go back and get it. Because we're gonna go in the sewer soon. And that sewer boss is a right dickhead. So yeah, let's just quickly go back and get the shotgun. I know this is a big pain in the balls, guys, but I'll be as quick as I can. And then we'll come back in. Is the shotgun going to be our best friend today? So, so Trisha says, yeah, just go back and get the shotgun. This is probably the most backtracking we're going to have to do in a while. Uh, the mo as I said, most of this game is pretty linear. So, um, here we go. We're just going to go into the simple lock. Where, where is the shotgun at? The shotgun was in the safety control room, wasn't it? So, up over here. Yeah, get the shotty. Nice and quick, because you're going to take on those... I don't want to spoil anything, but there's a certain enemy from uh, the original Resident Evil 3 uh, in the sewers that the, the sh shotgun, you, you're definitely going to need it. Oh, here we go. we got the bolt cutters. Wait till you really shoot, you'll love it even more. There we go, we got this bad boy now, guys. That's what's up. Alright, fine. Now back we go, everybody. This is like Cross Country Simulator 2020 Edition. Yeah, even, even, even though, like, uh, we're using Jill Valentine, the, 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 the design for Jill Valentine in this actually kind of reminds me more of Alice in the movies. Like, I'm like, is that Jill or is that Alice? I don't know, I kind of get a bit of an Alice vibe off her, but, you know, it's Jill. I feel, like, I feel like she reminds me of Alice from the movies, but, I mean, what do I know? Screw you, zombie sumbish. I'm trying to save all my ammo here. Oh, there we go, we got past. I'm practicing my dodging skills here. All right, we got this. Do you think it'd be cool if you made if they made a Resident Evil game where you played the villain? 
That would be a nice touch, but in this new uh, Resident Evil mode, that the multiplayer mode, you can play as a villain. So that's kind of cool, apparently. Uh, I'm just going to put that knife away for now. We're not going to really use it. Oh, there we go. we got plenty of room. Well, let's just do a quick save. So Trisha says this totally looks like Alice, you think? You enjoyed the movies? Uh, no, I enjoyed the movies. I just didn't feel like they really felt like the video games. Like, I enjoyed the movies for what they were, but I just didn't really feel like they felt like the games. I thought it was just their own thing. I hope when we get the reboot, it'll feel more like the games. Can you us? I don't think you can, actually, in this one, Nick. He's dead. I think it's pretty obvious he's dead. Sam Blaster Gaming says it wouldn't be Resi if you didn't backtrack. What the fuck? He was infected. He might have been infected. All oh, stars this soft. No wonder so many of you dead. And what are you, UBCS, killing your own people? I, I feel like the movies are just CGI fun. <laughs> There's your sense of self-preservation. Go back to the Jason says we need drive-up theaters now. Like we still got one in the area. It's the only one left in the state, I think, and it's like 20 minutes from me. Can we pick up anything off him? What's he got there? Training log. Well, oh, he's not going to need it anymore, is he? Poor guy. This guy is an absolute freaking psycho. Oh, we're going to go back over here. How you going, Johnny? Good to see you today. It's not going to be for a long, long time, Maddie. But we'll get through this, guys. We'll get through this. We got this. We got everything on lock. You know, we'll find plenty of things to do before everything goes back to normal. So, are we going to go down that corridor? Um, oh, hang on. Okay, let me just have a look at the back here. And make sure I didn't miss any ammo or anything. You got, Oh, what's down here? Okay, so see there is a handgun ammo. That guy just slit his own throat. That's, like, really disgusting. How you going, Rick? Good to see you. Thank you for coming in, man. Okay, we can't go that way. So, again, as I said, it's pretty linear. Just the one direction at the moment. He all ignored Reed movie. Christian, I, I all... Who ignored? I got really stuck here last night, remember? This was not fun. This, this was not fun last night. <laughs> did I get... Did I end up killing that dog? I think I got him. Yeah, he's just dead in the corner like the little bitch that he is. Oh, gosh. Are there any more dogs over here? Uh, yeah, the, 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 I think I should stay away from that gate right now. Okay, so there's one there. What's over here? Okay, cool. Item box. Do I have a red herb in here right now? No, I don't. That's alright. We'll work on that later. <clears throat> Cerebus equals not fun. No, they're not. <laughs> hey, we got Brittany in here. We got Southern Bell Gaming. Uh, Keith, I got this for PS4. Guys, if I do miss any comments, I do apologize. Don't forget, copy and paste is your friend. I'm just trying to get through this as quick as I can. So I've got my concentration face on. But now I'm playing the PS4 version today. I bought it digitally. And as I said, the only reason I've got it 16 hours earlier than you is because it was already the third over here. So I, I could pretend that I'm special, but I'm really not. <laughs> just the advantage of living in Aussie. Guys, don't forget to check out and follow my good friend Southern Bell Gaming here, guys. I know you're going to like this one, Brittany. But yeah, just, just one more reminder. In my first impressions, as I said, I played this for three and a half hours this morning. And I definitely find this game to be a little bit easier um, than the Resident Evil 2 remake. It's a, it's a little bit more, yeah, I don't know. I mean, just for my taste anyway. So Lauren says, but you are special. So you've been playing Resistance? What do you think of Resistance? So Curtis says you don't have enough room for your Final Fantasy 7. 
Yeah, man. I, I'm so excited. I've already got my copy of... I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to show you something. I picked up my copy of Final Fantasy VII Remake last night. Uh, for some reason, they delivered these uh, in advance to Australia and Europe. Obviously, probably because of the whole COVID thing. But out of respect to Square and to the community, I'm not streaming this until release day. I am going to practice for a week. But uh, I've already got my copy of Final Fantasy VII. So I'm going to practice and uh, try and get as good as I can at it uh, over the next week. And um, yeah, then I'll, I'll stream it for you guys. And uh, yeah, hopefully we can do a good job, huh? So yeah, ah, boo. So you, 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 don't 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 hate. I'm not showing off, guys. I'm still having respect for the community. No, there's no point in hating. <laughs> there's no point in hating, mate. What are we gonna do? Can we go in this? Where, where's this door? There's a door downstairs. All right, hold up. Wait a minute. Veronica says you're gonna go to bed. No worries, Ronnie. We'll see you later on. Hey. Oh, okay. Well, we're gonna save. I'm gonna get a little bit OCD on this save. I hope you don't mind. Matthew says if I stream Doom yet, I did stream Doom. Do I? Will I do another stream of Doom eventually? I will. Um. Okay. We're gonna need to leave the shoddy out for now. We're gonna put that away. Put that away. Probably put the gunpowder away. I'm hoping we'll get this backpack, another backpack soon, or a side pack. Yeah, Doom is very, very good. It's hard to stream and, and be a good host at the same time. I was like, oh, I don't even want to think about it. Just grind off the stream. No, oh, no, see, I'm going to start from the beginning when I stream it, but I just want to get good at it, so it's a lot easier to play once I'm on. Uh, we'll just... Oh, we're going to leave that go for a second. All right, let's keep going. What's over on this corner? Can we do anything here yet? No, we need we need a lockpick for that door. That's fine. Oh, here it is. I think there's a lockpick in this box. Josh, I, I've, I, I've installed it, but I haven't played it yet. I've only played the demo. I'm going to probably start playing Final Fantasy VII tonight or tomorrow. And just go really, really hard in my own time. So then when I play it fresh for you guys, I'm going to be ready. Here we go. We just got ourselves an aforementioned lockpick. Anything else over here in the corner? Here we go. We got that bad boy. Guys, if you know... By the way, don't forget, if you know any Resident Evil groups, uh, or any people, any gaming groups, any people that you think would might like to uh, watch this stream... Uh, don't be shy, guys. Give us a share if you could. Oh, here we go. This this thing. This is a thing that gives you the hepatitis. Oh my gosh, it's disgusting. Talk about violated. That is just fucking gross. Ugh, that is the that is the most disgusting part of this game so far. Yeah, I played Doom Eternal, Nick, I was just saying. Oh my gosh, you just got the old parasite. Get out. Get out, there you go, that's no good, is it? Alright, let's, let's get in this sumbish. Alright, ew. So just to, to get the parasite off, you just need a herb. Look at that, the parasite, ugh, that's disgusting. <laughs> this is where you join the street. Yeah, it was nuts, eh? So all we need to do is we need to turn on all the circuit breakers. At least those things are pretty easy to kill. That's that's a positive thing. We're just going to make sure that nothing eats us while we put them on. Is there anything over here? No, we got this one. So safe here. Here we go. Oh, there you go. So that's one. We're just going to put the pet. Oh, fuck it, E. Keep your ticks away from me. Hey, go on, Jason. It's good to see you. Thank you so much for coming in. What's on that side? All right, here we go. I think there's another one over here. <laughs> you want to put some bitch on a license plate? There's a herb. Oh crap! There's 
the herb in that back corner and we didn't get it before. We totally gonna need to grab that again. I've been pretty good on the health front for the most part in this game. But uh, the, the more herbs you, you get, definitely the better. Which goes without saying, but... Where is this herb? Here we go, we got this. So we just need to find another two of these breakers. Which, uh... Hmm, actually we're going the wrong way at the moment. We gotta go back around, my bad. Barkity, there's another one up the t Oh my gosh. So is it this one? Yeah, no, it's this one. Alright, my bad. So, so, uh, so Roger says this game is fire. Dude, I'm glad you're enjoying it, man. I'm really digging this myself, honestly. I think, I think this bad boy, oh my gosh. Barkity, get away from me, you stupid, creepy little freaking bug. Oh, we got him. So how do we get through here? Can we climb underneath? No. So we gotta, I don't know how to get in. Hmm. Ah, why well it doesn't... Hang on. No, wait, there is a new area. My bad. There is something we've forgotten here. Guys, I... There is a door. It's alright, we'll get through. In the meanwhile, we'll shoot all these stupid little freaking... Man, there's another one. I, I swear they're just respawning, hey. I saw... I, oh, gosh, okay. So, around here. There's like a... a Oh, right, here we go. So there's like a door and a breaker. All right, cool. We got this. Josh dropping another hundred stars. Thank you, Joshy. Appreciate that. What can we give to Josh before we move on? Josh, this is for you, sir. <laughs> James, you think I'm blazing through this time? I felt you. I, well, you know what? As long as you guys don't think I'm getting too stuck. I feel like for the most part I'm going okay. Oh, I think this is going to drop us down to another area. Alright. More handgun bullets. We've just got one more switch to put on, which is over here. Okay, that's no big deal. Easy peasy, as my friend Asker would say. Those look like American spiders. No, they actually look a lot like Aussie spiders. The only difference is our spiders are just a tiny, tiny bit bigger. But, but apart from that, they're very much like Aussie spiders. There we go, guys. We did it. That's all four on. Fantastic. Time to get the hell out of here. Yes, sir. Oh, my gosh. Surprise. <laughs> you, are, I, I'm tempted to get Animal Crossing, but I might have to wait till next month now. Because I've already spent my budget on games this month. Because I bought a lot of games I want to stream for you guys. Curtis just dropped a massive $3 super chat over on YouTube. Curtis, thank you so much for looking out, bud. What are we going to give to Curtis? Curtis, this one's going out to you. I'll do tier next time, Curtis. I completely forgot about that. Sorry, man. Curtis, thank you so much for the $3 super chat. So Aussie spiders have invaded uh, Raccoon City. Yeah, well, dude, you know, it appears so. I think we got everything we need, guys. I don't think we need anything else. I think I think we can get out of here forever, and that will be that. Oh, my gosh. I'm so glad that is done, my friends, for real. So Susan says, cool, you have a budget. A lot of people think I'm rich because, like, I'm a video game streamer because they assume everyone earns the same paycheck as Ninja. Okay. <laughs> Ninja, Ninja is like an exception to the rule, my friends. Now, don't get me wrong. I'm still in a blessed situation where I can keep a roof over my head and pay my bills. That's all I need. But a lot of people think I'm like a celebrity like Ninja. I am not. <laughs> That's, uh, Ninja's a different type of cat, you know what I mean? That's like a whole different level. If I was ever able to, would you have a one coin only game? Yes, that is a, a pet project that I want to work on one day. Um, so I do have some video game making experience. Yeah, so I have some personal video game making experience. And uh, making a game's always been something that's been a, a passion of mine. 
So, um, yeah, I'll either make one myself or when I have the money one day, I'll uh, get a developer to do it for me. If, if I make a one coin only game, it's going to be an 8 bit platformer. Just so you guys know, straight up, a one coin only game will be either an 8 bit platformer or a really, really violent old school shooter like Doom. I haven't decided yet. <laughs> There's a simple lock here. Okay, that's downstairs. Hold up, wait a minute. Rick's gonna find where the fuck he is in it. Do I use eBay or Amazon? I'm more of an eBay guy myself, though I have bought off Amazon before. Right. I think I know the building. I won't. I won't tell it, Curtis. I won't tell her. Not your partner. Where to find? Um. How are we gonna get out of here? Hang on. So we're down here. So where's this gonna take us? Oh, to get, oh wait, I've gotta go. There's like a lock over here that I need to find. Hold up, wait a minute. Um, oh, maybe it's out this area. I, this, this is like a lock that I need to, uh, hang on. So here, so there's something, let me just, I'm just looking for something for a second guys, bear with me. Okay, I think what we need's over here, there's something I need to unlock. That's what I was looking for, sorry. It's gonna be like, where is that freaking lock guys? It, did, did you just put one coin only, Austin, in the same reference with like a, a Biggie Smalls? Well, there you go, you're comparing me to Biggie. There you go. You, th you think my stream's a gangster? Well, I'll, I'll take that as a massive compliment. Thank you. <laughs> now we're going to unlock some of these other locks. There's a lock over here. Uh, Alright, let's, let's just keep going for now, guys. We got this. Oh, hello. How you doing? Let's get the fud fudgety out of here. That's no problem. Why can't Jill run quicker? She's useless. Frickin' Nemi, I gotta shoot that thing. There you go, piss off, Nemesis. There you go, we just elect we just fried the fucker. Alright, there we go, we got him. My gosh, get out of here, Jill. Seriously, you got no reason to be here. That's totally fried Nemesis, did you see that? Lester dropping the 50 stars, Richard dropping the 50 stars. Thank you, guys. Not until I get traffic control online. <laughs> this one's gone out to you fellas. Appreciate ya. Yeah, this is the new game, Max. This is uh, just come out. You guys in the United States uh, are going to actually have this get released any minute now. But uh, I was lucky, fortunate enough to get a little bit earlier. That's, that's plenty, man. That's plenty to keep you uh, occupied, Jeremy. So let's start putting some stuff away, guys. You know, we, we don't need everything in here right now. So let's put that away. Let's put that away. And, uh, yeah, we're going to keep the shotgun shells out for now. I think having a second gun will be somewhat handy. Um, Alright, so we need to start unlocking these locks. Bring the trains online at the subway office, which is all the way around here. Um, before we do that, we need to unlock that simple lock. Monument, simple lock. What's this one? What's this one here? Padlock door. I might quickly open that padlock door first and see what's up. There's a lot, a lot of things we need to do, guys. And it just gets a little bit overwhelming keeping track of all of them. Um, but yeah, alright. Can we go that padlock door? It's a, oh shit, the name. Okay, we're not going that way yet. Going that way probably would not be in my best inch. Fuck it, Gel, get the hell out! Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. There you go, Jill. You need to have some herb. You need to have some Jamaican. Fuck it, Jill needs to have some Jamaican team. Nemesis, I just fried your ass. Fuck it, get out of there, Jill. Why do you not run quicker? I tell you what, it's not like your life depends on it. Freaking Jill, man. So, hi, my name is Jill. I don't run very quick. Why? Because I think a, a knight in shining armor is going to save me. They're not going to save you, Jill. You've got to do this for yourself. I'm going to open this up. 
I got the download, Jan. I ended up getting the download uh, myself. Uh, yeah, okay, there's a save room in here. Time to rest. Alright, so no matter what happens, we're saved. No worries, Steve. Steve, you have a wonderful sleep, my man. And again, thank you for everything you do for the page. This is going out to you, sir. You're like my hero, Steve. <laughs> We'll see you in the morning when you wake up, my friend. We're gonna, uh, probably gonna, instead of Resident Evil tomorrow, I'm probably gonna go back to the Mario stuff, just for the people that don't like the horror. That's why I'm really, really hoping we beat this game today. That's what I'm working towards. Okay, so there's a chain door over here that we just need to quickly check. No problem. Fuck it, he's coming! Oh my gosh, he just scared me. I didn't realize he was there. All right, we're just gonna quickly go in this chain door. Fuckity, fuckity, fuckity. Oh my gosh, it is. Oh, let's open them. Oh my gosh, Jill, just get the hell out of here. As, as I've mentioned about 500 times, the only reason I'm playing this early is because I live in Australia and it's already April the 3rd here. So I haven't done anything special. I'm not special. Nothing like fuckity. How, what am I supposed to do in here? Alright, let's go. What's in this bad boy? Some shotgun shells. I went in here all for that. Alright, so what's in here? Man, did I really... Oh my gosh, there's really nothing in there that I need. We need to go back and get... Quickly get those shotgun shells, Rick. What's this? A hand grenade? Now get the hell out! Alright, we got him. Oh my gosh, Jill. Man, I, I, I regret going in here now. Alright, we're out. Let's go. Really didn't need anything from in there, did I? Let's see what our health status is. Danger. Oh shit, and I don't have a herb either. Houston, we have a, a little bit of a problem here. That's fine. Uh, Alright, where are we going to go now? We're going to go up and into the subway control room. Alright, hopefully there'll be like a box in there. Oh gosh, let's just go. Damn it, man. <laughs> Where about in Australia am I from? I am from Brisbane, my friends. I'm in the control room. I live in Brisbane, Australia. Nice place, good people. Pretty safe. Okay, give me a sec. A little bit boring just in the sense that there's nothing that you can do here that you can't do where you live. Uh, but we're smack bang in the middle of two like tourist destinations like Gold Coast and Sunshine Coast. So uh, Brisbane's a really, really good hub to visit for your holiday. But it's a lovely city, it's a pretty city. Uh, most people over here are very friendly. I, I do feel very fortunate to live here. All right, where are we headed? Don't worry, Susan. Hey, gone, Dion. So now we're gonna do this little subway puzzle. Hey, I'm super cop. So this is uh, the first station is is four. So F A. What was that? I think that's like F A one. F A one. The next one is, uh, that was it, F-A, what's the next one, Raccoon, F-R-2, so let's just, let's just press that, enter. Unable to establish. Oh no, I've got to do F-A, it's F-A-2, sorry, my bad, F-A-2, let's enter, let's see what we got. So R-A-2. I think I might have to go to RA4, actually. It's RA, RA3. Now let's press that again. And SA1. And then FO1. So I think FO, F, SA1 next. We, we, we were stuck on this for a little minute last night, but we got through it. Let's just go. Is it all of them? Maybe, maybe we need to do SA2 from here. I'm not sure. Maybe it's SA2. Let's see how that works. Valid route confirmed. Carlos, there we go, we got it. No problem. Easy this time. Payron says, you're not jelly of me having Final Fantasy 7 to See, exactly. He said, I'm doing the right thing and streaming it later. So, you know, I'm not going to do the wrong thing by people. Payron, this is for you. Thank you very much, my man. 
Peyron drop and the big 50 stars. Yeah, there we go. We got that. So we, we need to find some health, like, very quickly, man. Otherwise, we're going to be in big trouble. Um, so where are we going to go? Return to the subway station. There's, like, a simple lock in this other room, apparently. I, I hope Nemi's not in here. That, uh... So where, where's, where's this lock? There's apparently... A... Oh, here we go. Are you proud of me, Lamont? We got this all by ourselves. <laughs> Okay, so we, we, we're probably going to need to use that first aid spray. I'd rather use the herbs instead, but, you know, whatever. Don't forget, guys, if you're new here, uh, we stream every single day from 7pm until late. And, um, we also stream once in the morning at 9am, six days a week. So, uh, you know, if you want to see a ton of content, guys, don't forget to follow us. We'd love to have you more. Oh, wait, she went back to caution. Oh, I think because we're playing on easy mode, she recovers from uh, danger to caution. So that'll give us a little bit of a, a breather at, at, of, of sorts. All right, well, that's good, actually. Um, I don't know if there's any other... Just trying to think where else we can go. No, I think we can go straight back to the subway station now. Almost. Uh... Yeah. Well, let's go back through the donut shop. We're almost out of here, I think. I don't think we got too much left to do. Josh chopping the 50 stars. How you going, Jeremy? Thank you, Joshy. I'll be with you shortly, my friend. What the hell is it doing to them? Not today, bro. Oh gosh, he still got me. Here I was thinking I was all tricky and I could have... Oh my gosh. Ah, bro. Oh no, he just... He... Right, now, now we're definitely going to need this first aid spray. I've got no choice. Let's just get out. Get... Oh my gosh. Get away from me, Nemi. Dude, just fuck off. Excuse me. <laughs> Well, let's have a look over here. There's like a, a door here that we can unlock right in the middle, I think. Dude, get off me! Freaking hell, there we go. We got this. Let's see what's in this bad boy. Jeez, I'm getting really angry today, aren't I? I don't know what... Let's just see what's in this fancy box. It does look like a fancy smancy box. There we go. I don't know where the third jewel is. I've never been able to find that yet. Is there anything else in here we need? Apparently there's like a first aid spray in here or something. High grade gunpowder. So that's going to be to make shotgun shells. There's a first aid spray. You can never have enough of those as you've seen. And, uh... So, alright. Is there anything else in here? No, that's an empty room. There's like a padlock door over here, but I don't know how to get in. I guess we can have a quick look. Uh, padlock door. Can we... Oh, shit balls. No, we can't go that way. Fuck it! Stay away from me, Nemi. Oh, fuck, get off me! Oh, my gosh! Just piss off! Fuck it! Fuck off! Sorry. Oh, my gosh. And yeah, now I don't... I'm trying to... Fix, oh, my gosh. I'm trying to work out how to get him now. We've got to, like, run around these cars. Oh, my gosh. Just let me find my bearings. Here we go. We're going to get in this gate. Bruh. See, oh, my God. No worries, Nemi. No problem. Dude, just get the hell out of here. No, we're not hanging around with you no more, sis. Yeah, piss off. Oh, my gosh. Good. Go away. You don't need... Oh, my gosh! Oh, Jill, just get the hell out of here, please. Oh, goodness. Now where are we going to go? Subway station. So done. I'm so done with you. Oh, goodness. Josh and Timmy with the stars. Timmy, thank you for the 200 stars, man. This one's going out to both Timmy and Josh. 
Thank you, guys. Yeah, for the test, don't they put a swab right in the back of your nose or something? <laughs> does she run if you click L3? Yes, she does, but I was already running as quick as the game would let her. She, she's pretty terrible in that department, guys. I'm going to stall that. Let's just take out uh, one of these and one of these. There we go. And uh, we're going to put that away. What else can we use? Um, oh, we don't need that, so we're going to store that. Um, we just... Oh, gosh. Combine with this. A fantastic. Combine that with that. And... Uh, all right, we're going to put these gems over here. I think we need to get out. Yeah, they stick it right in your nose. I heard I heard it's very unpleasant. I think there was a green gem we were supposed to find as well. I guess we'll just take that. We'll put it in the chest again in a sec. Use the red gem. Ricky's rage level super sign. Yeah, man. As I said, the, the nemesis in this is just like a walking, like, anxiety attack. He's freaking nuts. There we go. So we're going to combine the shotgun parts. And we're going to put this grenade away. Then we're going to save, and then we're going to move on to the next part of the story. Oh, fan-fucking-tastic, fan everybody. <laughs> oh, we got this. How long are we in? We're already an hour and 20 minutes in. As I said, we are going to try and beat this game today, guys. Alright, so we use this lock pick over here. Hopefully there'll be something of value in here. We got more shotgun shells. Fantastic. You're going to notice very soon that we're never going to have enough of these. Thomas dropping the 50 stars. Thomas, thank you so much for looking out today. Alright, guys, let me just go to the bathroom while this cutscene's on. We back in business? Yeah, mostly. We need 30 to 40 minutes to finish maintenance. Nikolai, how are we doing? The town's crawling with those freaks. No chance of fighting our way out of the city. Why is she here? She's helping get the trains running again. Bad time to start getting dead weight through. She's unreliable. Can't pull the trigger when it counts. Hey, take it easy. She'll get you killed. You know, the thing is, you're not going to get an opportunity for too many uh, Everyone's a little worried. breaks in this game because it's just full throttle, like pedal to the metal all the time. Oh, come on. Not again. Josh, that is, um, that is a little bit of a stereotype. And uh, I can tell you, you know, this is a little bit inappropriate, but I can tell you firsthand that that is definitely not always the case. That is definitely not always the case, my friend. <laughs> Stars. Jason says Carlos looks like sounds like Roman Reigns, but looks like I uh, spit in the face of people who don't want to be cool. Yes, Carlito was a legend. I, there was some room, there's been rumors for years that Carlito was going to come back one day. We're going to try and shoot these barrels and. Um, Go, we did it. So now we got to open this grate, I think. Not my chance. Hey, going, Chris. It's good to see you. Yeah, man. Hey, going, Ben. Ben says you just woke up. Did I get a good sleep? I didn't sleep uh, too much uh, last night, to be honest, Ben. But the adrenaline's flowing through me because I'm just so hyped to play this game. So I'm still feeling good, all things considered. <laughs> You guess random number generator tells you otherwise. Nah, man, this is just, uh... Jeez, I, you know, I can't, I can't, I'm, gonna, I'm saying too much now. You're going to get me in trouble, bro. <laughs> You're going to get me in trouble. Hey, you going, Peter? Good to have you. I think we got some stars, too, that I haven't done thank you screens for yet. Sorry, guys, it's just been absolutely chaos. 
Thomas dropped 50 stars. Thomas, I want to thank you very much for everything you do, my man. My name is Bond. Bond. Thank you, Thomas. Bond. 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 James, James Bond. Bond. There you go, James Mother Bish Bond. All right. <laughs> See, here we go. We are in the, 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 the sewer, I think. We all know how much fun this section is. Uh, all right, so let's go in here. Is there anything we can put? Okay, we're going to combine this. And we're going to use one now too. Combine. Uh, we're going to hold off for as long as we can. Let's see what's in these. More handgun ammo. More shoddy shells. Do we need to put anything away? Yeah, we'll put the first aid spray away. Then we just, as I said, I'm a little bit OCD on the save. You have to be in this, seriously. Carl says, let's see and hear the game. You guys can see and hear the game. I love it how the... Hang on, I'm going to leave it, actually. I nearly said something that I, I couldn't take back. <laughs> all right, so... All right, we're going to go back from here. All right, cool. What's in that room? Is that like a... What is that? Oh, we have to go in from the other side, I think. I don't think we can... Right, all, all so far so good. Oh, everyone, not everyone can be a no-save expert gamer. Well, I mean that comes with time. You know what I mean? That just comes with time and practice. So we need to find a battery to get in that door. All right. Well, we'll find that aforementioned battery pretty soon. I guess we're gonna go down this way for now. Oh, there you go. I mean, you know, Jill is walking in a whole pile of turds right now, but, uh, I don't know. She's still got it going on, I don't care. <laughs> yeah, we got some big sumbishes to deal with pretty soon. It's pretty easy, though. All you need to do is keep it a distance. It's, it's not, you know... Which way should we go first? This way? No, this is it. Here we go. Let's look at this. All you have to do is keep it at distance, because these can one-hit kill you. I think usually three or four shots is enough to take care of business on these ones. Oh my gosh. Alright, we got him. That's one. James says, how are you enjoying the game and what difficulty are you playing on? And has Nemesis gone to the safe room yet? Man, that's a lot of fucking questions, James. But a very big welcome to one coin only. Uh, James, I am playing on Assisted while I learn the game. Um, I am enjoying the game very much. I think it's incredible. And Nemesis chases me absolutely freaking everywhere that I'm going to have a cardiac arrest by the end of the stream. So, big thank you for coming in, James. Hope you're having a great day. Ian says, time to go to sleep. Kill some undead bishes for you. Ian, I most certainly will, my man. Ian, have a great sleep, my brother. <laughs> Where is Timothy Dalton these days? I don't know what Timothy Dalton's doing anymore. So th these are explosive rounds here that we're picking up. They make uh, grenade guns, basically. Thank you, Lauren. I appreciate that. It's just telling you how to make it. Oh, there we go. We got the grenade gun. Fantastic. We ain't going to need to use that there yet. So let's put that away. Put that away for now. All right. Fantastic. Save. How you going, Paul? Good to have you. Some bitch love and miss you guys. Stay safe. You too, Paul. As I said, the world is going to shit right now. But you know what, guys? We are a resilient people. And uh, we are going to bounce back. So in the meantime, we're just all going to be there for one another, hey? I guess all we need to do is go up on this side now. So Gavin says, does this version live up to the original? Honestly, I prefer this one way over the original. I thought the original had much too tedious puzzles. This moves at a much quicker pace. So, or every day of the week, I prefer this one over the original. Uh, now, look, as much as I like the Resident Evil 2 remake, I actually prefer the original over that. 
But when it comes to the Resident Evil 3 remake, I prefer the remake over the original. For my personal taste. And, uh, alright, we're gonna go over here. There you go, Jill just running and all that shit, covering herself. Ew, it's so gross. Keep running backwards. Don't forget, these things can, like, one-hit kill you. But one more. Come on, you sucker. Is he dead yet? We got him. Alright, so let me just see where we're gonna go first. Uh, there's like a... It's like a corridor up here. Oh, that's right. So I think there's just like ammo and stuff over here. I remember we got a little bit stuck on this bit last night, didn't we, Captain BS? There we go. So we've got some gunpowder shells. Thank you, Carla. I'm not doing too bad here today, if I do say so myself. I mean, that could change a little bit later on, but so far, so good. Dookie shower. Yeah, I know. Just, uh, I mean, yeah, okay, I'm going to leave that one alone. You're going to get me in a lot of trouble, guys. <laughs> How you going, Jerry? Everything's going A-OK -okay today, my man. Thank you for joining us in the stream. How are you doing, Jerry? I guess that's a big question, huh? We got apes in here. Good to see you once again, April. As you can see, guys, like, this is only my second time playing through. And I've not really been, like, all that lost today. I haven't had any puzzles that have, like, overly frustrated me. Like, it's, um... You know, it's been a very run-of-the-mill experience. And, you know, it's, 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 uh... It's kind of refreshing that... I feel like with Resident Evil, sometimes the, the, the puzzles slow down the action a little bit too much. Uh, so, you know, I, the less puzzles for me, the better. But, you know, it's all subjective, I guess. Alright, we're going to have to combine that. We need to make some more room, guys. And we're going to use this green herb. I guess we can just pick this herb up and use it now, because, you know, why not? And uh, what's over here? <clears throat> so you fell asleep last night, so you're catching up now. I can't remember which part of this game you fell asleep on last night. Oh, we're going to go all the way back to the beginning now and start using this battery. Okay, I know where we need to go. Here for a second, I thought, oh, shit, I'm stuck. I don't know where to go. I know exactly where to go. Don't you worry. We got this. We got this on lock. Thank you, Joshy. Timmy says, Joseph just became a supporter on, face on, on YouTube as well as Facebook. Joseph, it's good to see you, my man. This one's going out to you. Thank you for letting me know, guys. Joseph, my brother, I hope you're having an incredible day. We don't talk that much anymore, man. I hope you're going great. Thank you for coming by. Thank you for everything, sir. Oh, shit, okay. Might want to run back this way, uh, Jill. Just a, just a suggestion. Oh, I'm kind of stuck. Is that it? Is he dead? Oh my gosh. Fucking shoot him, Jill. Fuck. Oh, I didn't get my gun out. Fuck, she reloaded in the middle of the worm fight, this stupid cow. That happened once last night as well. Stupid cow reloaded in the middle of a freaking worm fight. Is she freaking stupid? Oh my gosh. She's stupid, guys. It's official. No fucking brains. Alright, so what do we do? Okay, at least we can get... Oh my gosh, I need to take a chill pill. Now we have to do all this business again. Very angry here today, guys, you see? Very angry. <laughs> What's in this bad boy? More gunpowder? What's in this bad boy? Alright. It's alright, guys, we'll get it this time. I got eaten by the sandworm from Beetlejuice. I most certainly freaking did, didn't I? There we go. So we got anything else in here we need? No, we are outies, my friend. 
<laughs> alright, so which way now? It's alright, we got we got this. So we, we, yeah, we we were only stuck like a minute behind. So I think he's gonna oh gosh. Dead? Oh, jeez. He is dead. Alright, cool. So we're just going to go down through here and around. I think there's going to be one more spawn. Man, if I never see these things again, it's going to be too soon. No, here we go. We got this. Oh, surprise! No, we don't. Fuckity, fuckity, fuckity. Oh my gosh. Oh uh, yeah, can you... Oh my gosh. <laughs> you think I should just shoot it again just to make sure? What's this? A hand grenade? Nah, we got enough of those. I'm trying, I'm trying to free up as, some, as much inventory space as possible now. Uh, get back up there, Jill! What the hell? I didn't tell you to go back down. She's just so freaked out right now that she doesn't know what the hell she needs to do. Seth says he just got back from the hospital and he had the My Sharona. Oh, shit. Seth, how are you feeling, man? I hope you're okay. You know, a lot of us have probably had the My Sharona without realising it. You just made your girlfriend dinner because she had a really bad day at work? Well, look at you go. You're the boyfriend of the year, aren't you? Good on you, man. Happy wife, happy life, and all that kind of business. Oh, wait, they're in here too? What the fuck are you... Oh my gosh, you can't escape from them anywhere. Oh, dude, I shot... Oh! Wow, that, that was bull. I hit him three times with a gun. Usually only takes three shots. Oh my gosh, that just... Ah, oh, just so angry, guys. I can't help myself. This is really starting to piss me right off. Oh my gosh, Seth. I'm... I'm sorry you went through that kind of sickness, my friend. No, do we have to... Oh, no! No! Oh, come on! What a crock of crap! Oh, weak! Fucking weak! We have to go all the way... Oh, my gosh! No! Oh, God! Oh, my gosh! Are you serious? Oh, dude, that is weak! I'm so... Wow! Oh, that is weak! Oh, we have to go... Oh, my gosh! We have to go all the way... Oh, my... Okay, keep calm, Rick. Otherwise, it's going to happen again. That is all sorts of freaking bullshit. Oh, my gosh. Oh. I can't believe we had to go all the way back there. All right, guys. As quick as possible. Let's go. That is... Oh, man. I, I can't believe that wasn't a checkpoint, that building. Are you serious? All right, we'll get out of here this time. Maybe I just got really lucky last night. Hey, I don't know. See, see, I took four shots that time. It usually only takes three. It's all right. Brian says it sucks dying and having to repeat anything. I just feel bad for you guys, you know. What's over here? What's that? Hand grenade. Oh, we don't need the hand grenade. Uh, so there's going to be another one over here. We'll get Oh, shit. Surprise. Ex-mother-in-law, everybody. Ex-mother-in-law.
Come on. Almost got it. Oh, is he dead? So Michael says you would have thrown your controller at the TV. Now we got this, man. I'll just be a lot more careful at this room now. Does the gun reload automatically? You can reload it, or if the shells are out, it'll reload automatically. So you can manual or automatically do it. I do have a bad habit, I'm not gonna lie, at reloading at the wrong times. Here we go, we're back at this room now. Yeah, hopefully everything will be okay this time, huh? Far out. Oh boy. Alright, here we go. Now yeah, just be very careful at these steps, Jill. It's gonna jump out of here. Oh gosh, here we go. Back you go. Did we get him? That is it, my friends. Thank gosh. Josh says, Ricky, did you like Resident Evil 5? Yeah, I did like Resident Evil 5 very much, actually. It's been a long time since I played Resi 5, but, uh... No, I had, I had a great time with that back in the day. We just gotta unlock this door, get the battery, and then we're good to go. Big thank you for the 50 stars, by the way, Joshy. This is for you. Thank you, my man! Yeah, the four shell capacity is pretty crappy, but I'm wondering if you can find a part uh, later on that might give you more rounds in the... I don't know. Because what you can do is you can find different parts for your guns in this. You never know what you'll come up with. How you going, Pharrell? It's good to see you, man. I hope you're doing great today. Appreciate you coming by. Alright, so here we go. New room. Oh, another side pack. Gosh, you're not going to get enough of these. Then we're going to make uh, these uh, explosive rounds. Fantastic. Um, hopefully, we'll have, what's this over here? Gunpowder. We're not going to need any more handgun ammo for a while. Anything else in here we need? I have a funny feeling that this room's going to be the checkpoint. Looks like we got everything we need from there, so we're going to have to take this battery again. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, I would, I'd never ended up doing any multiplayer in Resident Evil 5 with anyone. I'd love to try one day. Pharrell says you're just kicking back and recovering. That's a spirit, good sir. It's a part that adds to... Okay, there you go, Roger. It's like a freaking big gigantic worm or something. That's for damn sure. What's that? Assault rifle ammo. Oh, dude, there was assault rifle ammo. We need to go back up. We, we can't leave that behind. That's a, a... No, we need to go back and get that. No, hang on. Where is that? Maybe it's down here. So, hold up. Wait a minute. Rick's got to remember where to find the ammo in it. Hang on. So the assault rifle ammo is over here somewhere. No, not that way. Up here, apparently. Let me just get this gun ammo. There it is. We, we don't want to leave that behind. That's for damn sure. Alright, guys. I think this is the last time we're probably going to need to use the battery today. So we're going to put this bad boy in. Don't forget to please smash that like button, guys, if you haven't already. And I just want to thank everyone so much for their kind and generous stars today as well. You guys have been incredible. You need a dragon breath for the shotgun. Carlos, can you hear me now? Jill. Oh, thank God. <clears throat> Everything okay? Yeah, I'm alive. I lost him. Great. The subway's ready to go. We'll leave as soon as you make it back. So we're about a half an hour ahead, I think, of where we were yesterday, all things considered. So the the Oh my gosh. We do have to do this boss battle first, I think. <laughs> You think so, Mikey? Oh, she's giving off that vibe a little bit, isn't she? Oh my gosh, escape the creature. Well, I'm going to certainly try to. Oh gosh. Oh man. How, how's the volume in everything? Is it loud enough? You can use weapons? You can use weapons. It looks that way, Jill. It looks that way. Uh, what's what's in here? We'll pick that herb up. We're gonna put that away for later. 
And um, we got some explosive rounds. So yeah, we're gonna have to put the, the shoddy away from, oh, hang on. Um, uh, we could actually, sorry guys, bear with me. We're gonna take out the um, grenade gun just for this fight. Where's, where's the grenade gun at? There you go, so we've got the grenade launcher. And uh, I right, can save. You're at full volume. So Troy says, will I be playing this in 20 minutes? Guys, I'm not even halfway through. I'm trying to beat this game in one sitting today. So uh, for those of you who are wondering, yeah, we, we ain't going anywhere in a hurry. We got this. How do I get up the top? We're looking for the staircase. Oh, here she is. Yeah, I've got the grenade launcher, Steve. Marco dropping the big 50 stars before we continue. Marco, this is for you. That's the most insensitive thing I've ever heard in my life. You don't understand anything, Kevin. You don't understand anything at all. <laughs> Marco, thank you so much, my friend. I guess we just gonna shoot these zombies with a handgun. No big deal. Is there, is there any other bullets or ammo here or anything that we could use? No. Oh my gosh. Just make just double checking everything here. I gotta get out. Quick. You think do you think I need to turn the game up a tiny little bit? Oh there you go. I just gave it a tiny little bit more juice. Just a tiny little bit. Remember to hit the gas tank. I'll certainly be trying to, my friend. Oh, uh, that's certainly what I'm trying to do. I do remember that from this boss. It's on his back. There he is, see? As I said, I think five grenade rounds will do. I don't want to waste too many. Any more after that, I'll just use a shotgun. Oh my gosh. Jeez, get out of here, Jill. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Crazy. You know, it kind of reminds me a little bit of Mirror's Edge and uh, Dying Light as well with all the climbing and the jumping and everything. Oh, okay, no, Ooh, we've got to keep going. Shit, okay. look backwards. I was trying to... Oh, there we go. So we do have another save area here. Fantastic. Us... Alright, cool. There we go. So no matter what happens, we're going to be able to start again from here. So we're not going to have to backtrack or nothing. I was going to put a couple things away. Alright, guys. We got this. Here we go. This is our first boss battle. Luther, Luther says he's off to bed. Luther, we'll see you again tomorrow, my man. You have yourself a great sleep, huh? We got One Link Gaming in here. Good to see you, One Link. Timmy, thank you for the 50 stars. I don't know what that is. But uh, it, 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 it sounds... Oh, crap. Cra shit. Right, what have we got over here? Where is this sunbish? Trying to, trying to get that thing on his uh, back. Oh, did I just totally miss him? That was a big waste of a round, wasn't it? Alright, there we go. We've got three more explosive rounds left. Let's make these ones count. Oh, Jill, get out of there! I'm pressing the duck button! You idiot, Jill. Doll's totally pressing the dodge button. She wasn't dodging. Freaking idiot, man. Jill, I was pressing the dodge button! 
All right, this one's going out to you, Timmy. We got it this time. One link says he's gonna play this tomorrow himself. Yeah, awesome. You think the nemesis? Yeah, I was trying to dodge, and she. I guess she can't dodge when you're on fire. I mean, in hindsight. I mean, I guess. Uh, I, I, I guess if you're on fire, I mean, your dodging capabilities probably go down the tubes. <laughs> Thank you, Lamont. Lamont, thank you again for all your awesome thank you screens, by the way. Lamont dropping another 50 stars. Before we go, sir, this one's going out to you. Let's do this. Leroy Dragons! Oh my god, he just ran in. <laughs> I'm kind of feeling a little bit like Leroy Jenkins today right now. He's going to keep it as much of a distance as possible from his sunbish. My gosh, dude. Oh, he dodged that one. That was it. Look, the, the freaking uh, nemesis here is self aware. Let's, let's use this bad boy. That's right. Where is he? Oh, he just dodged it. Are you serious? We're going to have to use the shotgun for the rest of it. That's fine. We're going to get him. we got the shotty here. Maybe I could hit the, the tank. The tank is... There we go. We got him. Oh, that's it. That's it. He's... Oh, we got him. That's it. Gosh, he's still alive. What the hell? It's, it's still okay. kicking, apparently. Yes. Oh my gosh. Just burn, dude. Burn. Oh my gosh. This is crazy. Alright, now he's dead. Alright, so we actually did do pretty well there. Oh, Jado says you watched the ending of the Resident Evil 3 remake on YouTube. Please don't give anything away, Jado, because we're going to try and experience for ourselves today. But if you can help us with the puzzles, Jado, by all means, do so. The dodging's almost exactly the same in this as it was in the original, Steve. You know how in the original you push the zombies out of the way? It's the same system. I ran out. I didn't have any left, Nicholas. Right, so we're gonna. Okay, so at least he'll leave us alone for a little while. Where are we gonna go now? I, I guess so. Let's have a look back up this way for a second. Yeah. I want to make sure there's no ammo over here or anything. No. <clears throat> what were you thinking? Turning yourself into bait. You know, but you don't know the puzzles. Oh. Don't start. Oh, that's all right. I I well, never mind. I know. And thanks. thanks. The subway's ready. And we're not even halfway yet. I'd say we're probably about a third of the way. Not even a third. Probably more like a quarter. I think at the moment. May maybe a third. No, actually, we're about a third of the way. I think. I think. I think. Yeah, about a third. So let's just see which any any anything in here we need to grab. I guess we can run down here. As I said, I'm just trying to find as uh, much ammo as I can before I leave. So I'm just going to go down all these these corridors. Just make sure I find any hidden items or or whatnot. There might be a. There we go. There's like a box here. There could be something in high grade gunpowder. Fantastic. We can make more shoddy rounds of that. <clears throat> Hey, go on, Vinny. This game is fantastic. I'm really loving it, my friend. I've been been having a great time with this all day. Um, we're gonna be trying and we're gonna try to beat this one today, guys. Don't forget. So, uh, we just got oh, we got this gun shop to go in now. 
Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna try and beat this sucker today. Is there anything over here? No. We're gonna be able to pick up a lot of cool stuff from in here. What's that? It's a semi. Oh, so that's like a shotgun piece. All right, well, cool. Keep looking. More gunpowder so we can combine that. It's going to turn into more shoddy shells. Alright, let's keep looking. Kaboom! Shit, chill. Kendo, you're alright. Yeah, I'm alright to stretch. Sorry, yeah, it's a police. Yeah, we're gonna be in the police station soon. By the way, Dex, that's something also to look out for. We're using the subway to get people out of town. Timmy says, any future new games coming out? Yeah, we're gonna be streaming Final Fantasy VII next week, all weekend. So, uh, Final Fantasy VII weekend next weekend. What's wrong? We'll smash that out over a bunch of days. Just bad timing is all. Well. Look, um, don't worry about me. I'm gonna make other arrangements, okay? You better. You're the best gunsmith around. Josh oh, says no. he can't wait for Final Fantasy VII. Oh, that's, that's your job, right? <laughs> Take care, Jill. So there we go. We got this. This is gonna unlock the gate around the corner that's gonna get us out of here. If you're heading to the station, take that service alley out in front of the shop, right, so okay? We got, okay, so we can dump some stuff. Uh, so now you now we can use six rounds in the shotgun by the looks of it. So there you go. See, uh, we're gonna save in a sec. Just gonna make sure I get everything. I don't think there's any more ammo in here. I don't. Oh wait, there's a first aid spray here somewhere. We're just gonna find where that first aid spray is, and I think that'll be. Um... Oh, I know there's a, a herb. That's okay. No, we got everything we need in here now. I'm gonna put this away. We're gonna save this some bish and we're out of here. <clears throat> you think he's been bitten and he's not telling her? It's a bit deep, isn't it? Hey go on, Punisher James, good to see you. Resident Evil 3 does take place before and after. Currently we're taking place before. Well you just wait until we get back to Raccoon City Police Department. Raccoon City Police Department in this uh remake is freaking awesome. It's really, really good. Wait, no, not that one. This one. There we go. We are finally out. And uh, we can dump this. We can dump anything with the... Uh, you know, if you, if you don't need to use an item anymore, it'll have like a little garbage can on it. You just get rid of it. What you need to do is you need to shoot them in the body and then you shoot them in their head once they're on the ground. That's what I've noticed with those things. I don't know if there's a better way to do it or not. Alright, so what's in here? Last of Us 2 is delayed indefinitely. You're upset about that. Um, yeah, it's a shame, but we'll get the game eventually, guys. You know, we, we just gotta... Do... A lot of shit going on in the world, guys, and, you know, we just got to do our best right now, you know? As I said, staying healthy and making sure the world doesn't go into chaos is our, our first priority right now. That's definitely my biggest concern. I'm glad one coin only in the meantime can be a place where you can just forget about the bullshit for a little while. So Jerry says, shoot the legs first. Oh, yes, put him... You know what? That's probably a better idea. Jerry, you're a much smarter man than me, sir. If he, if he can't stand, he can't fight, right? I mean, that's wasn't that one of the number one rules in Karate Kid 3? If a man can't stand, a man can't fight? Quote Terry Silver. I think I'm paraphrasing here, but... You, you guys all know how much I love Karate... Oh, my gosh! Cheese balls! Yeah. 
Yeah, I heard it looks like Money in the Bank is cancelled as well. No, that won't be cancelled. That'll be postponed. They'll, they'll just change the dates around this year, I think. Oh my gosh, nuts. Let's get the fudgety fudge out of here. Oh my gosh, this is freaking nuts. Oh my gosh, get out of there, Jill. <laughs> oh boy. Josh says you haven't got out weeks. Really looking forward to getting away from the kill. Oh. <laughs> yeah, my uh, my my sister and my brother-in-law. Uh, well, my brother-in-law's an essential, as they like to call it. Isn't that isn't that convenient? But but my sister's stuck at home non-stop with the kids right now. So you know, as much as she loves her kids, she's probably going to say the same thing. Jason says the fact you know Karate Kid 3 is cool. Man, you know I love Karate Kid and Cobra Kai. I'm just wondering how long Cobra Kai is going to get delayed with everything going on. Nick, you hang in there, my brother, hey? You, Nick, I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to promise you, Nick, you're going to bounce back from this. I don't know if there's anything in there that we actually, you know what, let's just go. <clears throat> oh gosh, alright. Anything over here we need to grab? Jill, you there? I think I know how to slow that fucker down. Head back towards the station. And lead him right to you? Okay. Dave says they have too many pay-per-views as it is. I think there are too many, man, because they don't feel special anymore, do they? I I don't yeah, I don't think they really feel all that special. Right, we're almost out of here, guys. So where where are we gonna go? Um I'm just trying to figure out the easiest way to get back to the station. We're gonna go the long way around. Uh just following all this. I don't know. Trying, trying to we'll figure this out in a sec. Hold up. We're just going to go down here on the bottom floor. Okay, so we're going to go across here. Okay, now this is easy enough. Now look, Nemi's going to turn up. Oh, here we go. Pee Wee Herman's going to come after me. Holy shit balls! Oh my gosh. Pee Wee, get away from me. Oh, Nick, no dramas at all, my man. I'm not going anywhere. Between me and D-Wayne, you're going to get like 10 to 12 hours of one coin a day. And obviously, you guys are going to get even more on Mondays when you got like Commodore. So, yeah, man. We just, you know, this is, this, this is more than ever now. We need to up our game, you know. Everyone's going crazy being the stuck of their house. We just need to make it a bit easier. Yeah, all right, I'm coming, Carlos. Coming, mate. There you go. That was a bit of a... How was that, a Claymore? I used to love using those in Call of Duty. Well, he looks really pissed Go. off. You just made him angry. Out of here. All right. Is there a chest here anywhere yet? I kind of need to play around with some stuffs. Oh gosh. So we're officially out of Raccoon City. We're going to the other areas now. Thanks for the save. Hey, you saved my ass first. You're a hell of a lot braver than me. Well, what matters is that we can get everyone out of the city now. 
Yeah. Hey, you'll be safe. What about you? Uh, from the sound of it, I won't be catching the train. Is there anyone in here actually that's played through any of this shit? As I said last night, we got about three of the ha three and a half hours in, and I wouldn't go as far as to say I was stuck at the hospital, but I kind of ran out of options on where to go. Um, but I didn't try that hard either because it was time to go to bed. So I'm not really concerned about anything in this game until we get to the hospital. Apart from that, it's all pretty linear. Good work. Vinny says he's stuck at home for the time being. It's pretty boring. I feel you, man. I'm sorry to hear. Tyrell, you have your orders. You need to go back out into the city and find Nathaniel Bart. This isn't the last man out of town, right? Do not worry. Once the civilians are safe, the train will be back. It's all right. You're going ahead. I'm not going to die on you. Don't forget to smash that like button, everybody. Okay. The more, the more likes we get, the more people will we come in. We can have one big gigantic party. Peyron says, how long is this game? Apparently it's six hours. Um, so yeah, I mean, I, I guess six hours. Good luck. Yeah, the quickest I've done the original Resident Evil 3 in three hours. Man, it takes me a lot longer than that. I'm not very good at Resident Evil 3. <laughs> I could beat the second one pretty quick. You don't really <coughs> do pins and push it like Martin is still alive, do you? I have a done good authority. <coughs> Are you worried We're just about to go there uh, now, Jonathan. Or something else. We're very, very close. Funny how brainless zombies can ambush. Gil says you've been watching your streams a long time. It's always a thank you, Gil. Break no party like a one coin party. <laughs> so one coin party don't stop. Okay, I think everyone gets the idea, Rick. <laughs> How is this fucker not dead yet? Just no, they're gone. Come, this way. Nikolai, what are you doing? Yeah, absolutely, Pharrell. I tell you what, this, it, I'm going to be honest with you, Pharrell. This whole situation right now has, has made me a lot more appreciative for the things that I've got. That's for damn sure. Get off my train, shit bird! Shit bird, eh? I'll take that shit bird. Yeah, no worries, Tyler. Thank you very much. I hope you enjoy and play the game soon. Reed, I picked assisted. Uh, you know, obviously I haven't learned how to play the game yet, so the easier the run that I have, the better. But there's three different difficulties. There's like assisted, normal, and uh, like a hard or something. Here you go. This is Raccoon City Police Department now. Been a while. Subway's got to be clear of the city by now. I'll no worries, Gavin. You have a great sleep, my man. Thank you for coming in. No, she's not like that. No, she's Dex says like he st stumbled here randomly. Nice content, sir. Like how you keep communicating. Absolutely, man. You can't take the people that are watching for granted. It's the most important thing of all. Dex, I hope you're having yourself a wonderful day, my friend. All right. Hope you're uh, finding plenty of things to do while stuck in the house. <clears throat> you sure? Looks like a cemetery to me. Carlos is really, really fun to, to use. I find that he's got a, almost a practically unlimited supply of like machine gun ammo. I never ever felt using Carlos in this game that I was ever running out of ammo, and uh, he's just incredibly fun to use. Come on, man. Not you too. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. See, now you find out how Marvin got bit. Shit, it's locked. You stay on the door. I got this fucker. Come get some. 
We gotta remember to pick up the key card from out here because we forgot that last time. So I think we just gotta pick up the card for him. See, we had to go all the, come all the way back out last time. He starts. There you go. So Brad unfortunately died a very horrible death. Where'd that cop go? Don't know, don't care. We got a job to do. So I'm gonna open this. I'm gonna put the knife away. We don't need the knife. Leave everything else out. Our intel's still worth a damn. Then Bard's Maybe the it's time office. to quickly save. Let's find him and <clears> take him into custody. Custody? I thought this was a rescue. I don't think I think Brad was in the process of sort of like turning. Carlos, I think that you might have just had like a percent of humanity I left. The stars office. Remember. Bard had access to Umbrella's darkest secrets. He knows we'll try to keep him under our thumbs. So this search and rescue mission is really more like find and detain. I think I think this is better than number three. Like as I said, I think the original Resident Evil 2 is better than the Resident Evil 2 remake. But I think the Resi 3 remake is better than the original Resi 3. It just uh it just feels it's it's it I love the extra story elements to this. I feel like it's more intense. There we go, so we got that. So I think all I need to go... Now I'm just going to quickly duck upstairs, guys, because there's going to be, like, extra ammo and things like that we can grab. Oh, there we go. So we got, like, grenades too. I mean, woohoo. So, you know, we're just going to make sure we check everything. Um, Alright, so we're just going to go for one quick look upstairs, and then we'll go in that door. Just tell me now that the birds... I don't remember any birds in this one, but, uh... You know, I don't want to turn out to be a liar or nothing, you know what I mean? Now here's a weird fucking door. Leave it! We're here for bar. Alright, no, we're just gonna go back this way, no problem. Doesn't, um... I've never played the Resident Evil Outbreak files, but don't, doesn't those games go more into these little side stories? I want to do the outbreak files eventually. I need to practice them first because I've I've not not really experienced them. But that's that's on the homework list. Nicholas says you're only one on Facebook at the moment. It's quiet here. It, it's pretty normal for the chat to get quiet this time of uh, night. It's what time is it? It's starting to get pretty late, especially on the east coast. And you know sometimes people just like to chill and watch. You know what I mean? I'm not gonna. Hold no chat against anybody. Alright, let me alright, so here we go. I'm just gonna save here one more time now that we got everything. Let's go in this next area. Jerry says you swear Carlos is a twin of Miguel from the Tekken series. Was that you that said that last night? I think someone else said that. Here we go. So let's we've got this key card. Let's open this box. Timmy says he's still here and on YouTube. Thank you, man. Oh, we got this. Next area. Yeah, it's only 3 three p.m. No, it's 2 p.m. here. Don't forget, mate. I'm from fucking Queensland. Fucking Queensland. Queenslander! You know, state of origin and all that. He probably could, you know. I know Viper's incredible at this. Hey, we got Heather in here. Good to see you. Heather says, you look tired. Have you been sleeping and eating well? I know I have big black uh, disgusting bags under my eyes right now. I know it's not that pleasant. Uh, Heather, I have not been eating or sleeping well. I'm not, I would never lie to you, girl. I've not been eating or sleeping well. I promise you, one thing I will promise you, though, is I will try my best to change that. That, But uh, no, I've, I've not been sleeping or eating well. <laughs> I, I, ca I cannot lie to you. Uh, here we go. Here we go back in the police department. <coughs> Excuse me. So April says we'll be on the same time soon. Ricky Daylight Savings finishes soon. Where when do when does that finish? Is it this weekend? It's this weekend, right? That's right. We are gonna all be on the same time zone. So Heather says you better be or you're grounded, young man. I'll take it as a compliment that you just called me young man. Being that I'm like 40 this year and everything. Thank you, Heather.
Okay, oh, well, I'll try to be on a, the lookout for it, Nick. No worries. There, there's something in this room. Okay, there we go. Flash grenade. So let's have, have I got everything we need in here? Let's have a look. No, we got. If you got it, if you're in a blue room, that means there's no items left in there. There you go. Some more assault gun bullets. It's another blue room. Fantastic. T, you copy? There's something real nasty in here. I don't know what it is. Something nasty. All right. Yeah, 40 years young. Yeah, you know, ho hopefully with modern medicine and everything, most of us, you know, I think 80 plus for most people now is not out of the question, fingers crossed. Although I do need to eat better if I want to last that long. I'm trying to use my handgun for as long as I can. And then just stockpile these uh, machine gun bullets, you know. Got that sorted. Awesome. All right, so let's see what's in the west office first. <clears throat> Matty, thank you, man. Matty just dropped the 50 stars. Matt, I really appreciate that. Matt, this is going well, out to you. Excuse me. Matt princess. says he's watching you and well, NBA 2K3 League princess. listening. Well, These guys talk trash online. Me, princess. Well, there you go, Matt. You you listen to that trash. No, I understand. I, I, to I totally get it, Heather. <laughs> How about you, Heather? What are you up to tonight? Apart, apart from watching this sumbish, what are you and Joshy and the kids all doing? Oh, we got... we. Oh, gosh. I can't remember what the code is for this save. I forgot to write this save code down. Hang on. Yeah, I for I've forgotten this save code. I think it was... We have to come back to this safe after anyway, that's fine. Oh, I'm out of handgun bullets. This is our cue, guys. Bring bring out the big guns now. Oh, gosh, this is nuts. Any anything in here? Hopefully some handgun. No. Let's have a quick look around in here quickly. So we need to open this desk. Curtis chopping the $2 super chat. Curtis, thank you, brother. Glad to see you're still in here. And uh, let me see if I can find this. Where is True Lies? This is for you, Curtis. Thank you, sir. <laughs> no, I understand. I hope everything's okay. I do worry for you, Heather, since you're definitely in the firing lines and everything. Just, just want you to be safe, my friend. Uh, okay, there we go. So we got this uh, herb there. Can we combine anything yet? We can indeed. Anything else in this? There's, there's handgun ammo over here, apparently. Oh, cool. So we'll go back to their handgun for five minutes. Don't think there's anything else important in there right now. So we're going to... We're going to come back in here for the safe later. Uh, Nick, man. Oh my gosh. I, I, sorry, sorry, Nick, man. I just don't know how to reply to some of the stuff you say sometimes. As I said, man, I just want you to be well and ha happy. But, um... Jeez, bro. Try, try to keep the full-on stuff out of the stream, hey? Oh, we're gonna go up, up this... Oh, gosh. Right, so we're gonna go down this bottom area first. There's gonna be a save zone here in a minute. Oh, here we go. 9-15-7. Okay, so there we go. We can quickly go back and do the safe code. <clears throat> she is. 9, 15, and 7. Can we put anything away? Is there anything we don't need? Put that away now. 9, 15, 7. What's over here? What, what's this button do? Just turn that on. Now I think I just got a star donation, guys, but it didn't pop up. If you, I think I heard a ding, guys. If you just sent a star donation, can you please let me know so I can give a big thank you? 
because uh, it hasn't come up on my end, guys, and I, I don't want to be rude. Just, just, just holler at your boy. We'll get ya. Sorry about that, everyone. Sometimes it doesn't always come up. Right, here we go. So, okay, so it's 9, 15, and 7, isn't it? All right, we got to quickly go back to the safe. Oh, wait, I think we're going to need to pull out this, uh... Just be careful. I think there's going to be a licker here in a sec. No, not yet. Um... Alright, so we're just going to quickly go this safe. <clears throat> I'm going to write that down, actually. 9, 15, 7. That'll save us a lot of time. 9, 15, 7. There we go. Let's see what's in this bad boy. Oh, another backpack. Okay, we totally needed that. <clears throat> Alright, now I think all we need to do is go in this upstairs area now. As I said, there's a little bit of backtracking in this. But obviously, compared to the Resident Evil 2 remake, it's quite minimal. So it's no big deal. Carlos, Carlos, <clears throat> the star's office is up ahead. Copy that. Oh, Nick sent 50 stars on the Facebook. Nick, this is going out to you. Thank you, bud. Thank you, Nick. Appreciate those 50 stars. Oh, for fuck's sake. Why is it blocked? Ooh. Is there a Resident Evil 1 remake? Yeah, there is a Resident Evil 1 remake. But it plays more like the original, just with, like, better graphics. And, uh... Just as tricky of puzzles. Uh, what's the save code in the shower? Uh, cap. Better not. So we just need to find the battery for this. We're gonna blow up this wall to get uh, to the star's office. Um, just can't remember how. Oh, wait, we gotta go downstairs and get the battery. Shit. Oh, back downstairs we go. Sorry, guys, we forgot something. We gotta go to. Wait, we need to find the storage room key, and I don't know where that is. Maybe we need to go up these stairs. Okay, hang on. Maybe we need to go up these stairs first. <clears throat> Okie dokie dokie. Oh, there it is. That's what we need. Now we can go downstairs and get the battery. Fantastic. What's in this one? What's this code? Uh, third floor, DCM. Might just be some ammo or something. Oh, gosh, we're almost out. <laughs> What else is everyone getting up to this weekend? Anyway, I want to say happy Thursday, guys. We're not too far away from the weekend now. You guys got any, like, good TV shows, good movies, good games planned to watch? You know, I kind of like to, like, you know, you guys sometimes inspire me to find things to do in my downtime. The little downtime that I have. You surprised they didn't go with DMC instead? Yeah, a little bit, little bit of a throwback there. I think there's going to be a licker here now. Be a bit careful on this one. Dude, where'd he go? How many times are you going to shoot that guy? Oh no! Oh, weak. Carlos, you might need to use a bandage. Like how many freaking bullets you gotta use on the liquors in this game? Yeah, 99 fucktard. Oh, here we go, this is the key. 
Nick says he's laid off. He's got plenty of downtime. Oh, the Tiger King. I really don't know a whole lot about this uh, di Tiger King, to be honest. You go oh, shit. Okay. He can't grab me if he's got no head. Alright, yeah, so all we need to do is explode that shower now. Yeah, that liquor ain't happy, right? Alright, so let's go and, and grab these things. So we need the battery. I wonder if there's like another like hip pack here or something. Probably not. Mine now. Alright, so what, what's in 109? That's just a grenade. I don't really care about that. So we're going to combine this with the battery and we're going to go uh, blow up that wall upstairs that we couldn't get through. Which way, which way is that? I think it's just down this corridor. Alright, cool. How you going, Phil? It's crap, but it's the only thing on Netflix right now. Is it really that bad? I heard a few people tell me it was overrated. Nick says he wants to go to let off some steam in a range, but they're closed. My friend is a, a gel blast. My roommate, I mean, is a gel blaster enthusiast. And he's just set up target practice in the house. And he's just shooting his gel blasters right now. That's kind of keeping him, like, relaxed. <laughs> No, that's okay, Mikey. I hope you have a great sleep, my friend, hey? Move. It's all good, sir. Thank you for coming in. Hey, go on, Thomas. Nice to have you. Oliver says she keeps seeing Tiger King memes. You have no idea what or who he is. Yeah, I don't I don't know. I don't really know anything about the Tiger King. I did see an advertisement for the first uh, time last night for Big Show's new show. I, I, I feel like it's just, um, I don't know, I, th I think it's going to be an interesting dynamic because Big Show's a former wrestler and they're playing into that, but the Big Show show just kind of looks like your typical generic uh, sitcom with the pre-recorded crowd and, and, you know, it doesn't doesn't really look like anything you haven't seen before, you know? But hopefully it's a good show, I'm not going to be too judgmental. We're gonna, we're gonna look for items in here. Any, anything over here? No. Oh, bro, get off me! Oh, son of a, they just snuck up on me behind. Fuck it, hey! I'm just gonna pull out this freaking gun again. So Ryan says, hey Ricky, you just started at midnight, right into the action right away? Yeah, nice. There you go, I think everyone on the east coast of the United States now has access to this game. So big congratulations, I hope you enjoy. Big Show would host like, you'd, you'd like to see Big Show host something like Wheel of Fortune, or that'd be funny. So I could live with that. Oh my gosh, there's liquors here again. Jeez, let's just get out of here and reload the gun. <clears throat> Where is that thing? Here he is. Oh, we got him. That was lucky. Any Anything in this corridor we need? I guess we'll figure that out in a sec. Before we go in the star's office, I am just going to look uh, around here and just make sure we haven't missed anything. Because according to this little thing, there's something over here. There we go, more ammo. You're definitely very encouraged to check every like little corner in this, that's for sure. And so Curtis says, you're not buying this game depending on you to show me... Okay. You're not interested, huh? Dr. Bard. Oh, thank God. 
you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital, surrounded by every kind of abomination. Look, just send in stars. They're gonna know what to do. No, negative. RPD's so Nick says, what too. the hell that room has. I guess power isn't cut out everywhere. So Richard says this kind of game gets your anxiety. Yeah, you and me both. Trust me, don't I know it. This hasn't necessarily... I, I, I hate to break this to you, Richard, but this hasn't necessarily been a, a picnic for your host either. <laughs> it, hasn't been, it hasn't been a total host for one coin only. I mean, a total... You know what I'm trying to say. I can hell, Rick. Yeah, you would. You heard what he said. As I said, we are going to try and beat this game in one sitting today. That's my goal. That's Mihail's call. I'm going to check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. Nick dropping uh, $4 super chat. Nick, thank you very much. Nick's over on the YouTube. Nick, this is going out to you, bro. There you go. Curtis actually got that too. <laughs> thank you, Nick. What do we got? What's in what's in this sunbish? We're just gonna make sure we get everything we can out of this and then it's gonna go back to Jill, I think. So pretty much we're just getting all the ammo and stuffs. Dex says you can't buy the game because you're under lockdown and all establishments are closed except for groceries. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm guessing you don't have a way to get it digitally then. You, you must only be able to get things digitally at the moment. Well, that's a bummer. Well, hope, you know what, guys? Hopefully I can get you through until you can get a copy for yourselves. Don't know if there's anything else in here we need to grab. We're going to store, store all this. We don't need this key again. We don't need that car, card again. Apparently there's, a, there's, another, there's another first aid over here. Oh, no, Sir Herb. Alright, we got everything, so all we need to do is leave this room, and that, my friends, is that. Alright, fantastic, let's let's bounce. I'm glad you enjoying, William, Derailed. thank you very much. Derailed. Was anyone hurt? Jill? Ah, oh, shit. Wait, what? Jill! Jill, what happened? Jill, <sighs> come in! Curtis says you want to travel Dear right now. Do what you gotta. I'll take yeah. you apart. Yeah, I um, I mean, you know how much I love travel, but I just want the world to get back to normal and everyone be okay before I sort of. I, I think maybe in a year, year and a half, I'll I'll start taking up my passion of seeing the world again. Right, 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 right now, I just want to focus on trying to be a better sunbish than I was before everything hit the fan. Once you get the bug to travel, it's really, really hard, Curtis, to put it away. It's a wonderful thing. It's, I just can't even explain what a great feeling it is to be somewhere else. It's almost like, it, like when you go to a new country, it's almost like you're on a different planet. And then everything else back at home, uh, just, uh, you know, it either doesn't matter or doesn't stress you out anymore. It's just a, a great release. At least for me, anyway. <laughs> Williams, well, the graphics are really good. The Resident Evil uh, engine is is pretty freaking fantastic. I'm digging it. So I think. I... Carlos, come in. Carlos. Mm. Oh, damn it! I guess I'm out of range. So I guess we're just gonna put some things away for now. I'm gonna pull out a couple green herbs. So what are we gonna put away? We don't need that yet. We don't need that yet. We don't need that yet. I just want to quickly pull out a couple green herbs. Um, there we go. Just to combine with these. Uh, we just got some housekeeping to do. That. So there we go. We're going to put these mixed herbs away. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What did I just do? Can I get open? Put this away. Store, store. Now I'm just going to combine these grenade rounds very quickly. As I said, all we're doing is just some house housekeeping very quickly. 
I'm gonna put that away. Save. All right, we're ready to go. Just good, some good housekeeping here, guys. Uh, Nick says, if I ever been to the United States, I was there a year and a half ago. I managed to meet D Wayne and a few of the fans of One Coin Only. Uh, I went to uh, uh, Massachusetts, drove through New York on the highway, and then we're at Connecticut uh, for um, Retro World Expo. But the only time I spent anywhere was Connecticut and and Massachusetts. Love Massachusetts though. I thought it was really cool. I know I know a lot of people in here are not fans of Massachusetts because of the football, but uh, I thought the people there were really nice. I felt very welcome. <laughs> Who's coming after me? This is keep going, Rick. Oh gosh. Do I think they'll remake Resident Evil 4? Uh, maybe. Oh gosh! Fucking hell! Sorry, guys. Uh, do I think they'll. I guess eventually. I think that the, the priority is going to be Code Veronica first. Oh my gosh! Are you kidding me? Fuck off. Sorry, guys. I'm just getting a bit stressed out here. See, I tell you, the anxiety attack is real right now. What's that, mine rounds? I don't really care about those. Hang on, guys, we need to go back. There was a first aid spray down here. Sorry, guys, give me one second. Didn't I have my first Frosty at Wendy's? I mean, we have ice cream in Australia, guys. I mean, Jesus, but yeah. I, I did I did have a Wendy's Frosty. I, I, did, I did have a, uh, a Wendy's Frosty. <laughs> All right, here we go. So, um, let's put that away. All right, now, now we can leave. Did you have you guys ever played that game Zombie before? Or it's probably called Zombie U if you had the Wii U. It's also on PS and I don't know if you guys have ever played that survival game Zombie before, but it's actually pretty good. I'm surprised it didn't get more love. Hey, go on, Meek. It's good to see you. Maybe a Resident Evil 4 remake will make Ashley a little bit less annoying. I mean, you can only hope, right? Oh, guys, this is a... I think we got a boss battle coming up. Or maybe that's not an escape. No, we got to escape. Okay, so this, this boss battle is not yet. Maybe that's coming up later. Hoping we'll have another chop. It's alright, if we just need to use a shotgun to beat this guy, that'll do. We beat the guy with a shotgun last night. You love Zombie U? Yeah, I thought Zombie U was pretty good. I never beat it, but I did put a lot of time into it. Bitch can't even swim. Carlos, respond. Yeah, yeah what's up? We didn't make it. The train derailed. Derailed? Was anyone hurt? No, everybody's dead. <sighs> Excuse Child, me. Everybody. Oh, shit. Yeah, Wii U is great. Guys, I would recommend if you're a, a game enthusiast and you like Nintendo, get a Wii U before they become too expensive because they never released many. Monster. Here we go. Yeah, we got to do another boss battle now. That's alright. I think the shock... I want to save all my grenade rounds for when we do a harder version of Nemi anyway, so... Let, let, let's just, we're just going to keep shooting him in the head with a shotgun, and, and that will be that. Come on. Oh gosh, like, really? We're going to use this grenade. Uh, we're going to use this herb here. It's just, I think there's plenty of shotgun shells to find in this area as well. Try 
how to get a big cool crap. I think the shotgun's not too bad. At least it's got the spread as well. Where's this selfish going? <clears throat> no, that's okay, Nick. Uh, yeah. As I said, Nick, I, 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 we just had to take action. What you need to remember, Nick, is this is probably one of the toughest times we've ever had to face in our generation. And we just can't have any negativity in here right now. You know, I mean, not that type of negative. Like, you know, we're all going through tough times. But, you know, we, we've got to draw the line somewhere. But you're fine. Another thing over here. Let me have a look. There's something in the car. Oh, some more shoddy shells. Great. There was like 16 of those bad boys in there. Night, night, Zana. You have a great sleep, eh? We got US Army guy. Hang on one second. Sorry, no, that's uh US Army veteran gaming. Sorry, my man. I was reading that. I was reading that a little bit quick because this uh good to have you. I was reading that a little bit quick. As you can see, Nemi here has got me very anxious at the moment. I'm, uh, yeah. Oh, gosh. We're gonna have him soon. Almost got him, guys. Oh, gosh. Crazy, man. We did it! I think. Right, let's do this. Guys, I'll be right back. I'm just going to have one more pee break. Carlos, you still there? Oh, come on. You're going to crap out on me now? God damn it. Guys, I am washing my hands. Oh my goodness. Oh. So sorry about that, everyone. I, I like to. I, I'm trying to wait till the cutscenes. Oh, there we go. So we got some more grenade rounds. Fantastic. We're going to be able to use those for next time. Just going to make sure I'm, I pick up as much ammo as we can before we leave. Devin with the 50 stars. Devin, thank you for the support today. This is for you. Thank you so much for your kindness. Don't forget to bring a towel. <laughs> Thank you, Devin. Appreciate that. We're just quickly having a look for the last of the ammo. And uh, then we're going to bounce. Uh, I think we pretty much got everything. I mean, there's... Okay, there's a, another box over here. Oh, fantastic. See, I'm glad we looked around because we're going to need to put all this in the chest. All right, we got everything. So we got this over here. And Duran just dropped another 50 stars. Duran, thank you, sir. I'll be right with you, my man. I think we just got a little cutscene here to do quickly. Thank you for supporting the stream, Duran. Really appreciate you, my friend. We got Will in here. Good to have you, Will. Uh, Army Veteran Gaming. Uh, dude, look, I'm... I'll tell you one thing, US Army Veteran Gaming. I'm better than I deserve. You know, I'm... I'm... I'm very, very fortunate under the current circumstances. Let's just put it that way. So, I'm, I'm better than I deserve, and everything's okay here. Thank you, man. I hope everything's reasonably alright on your end, too, man. You'll have to let me know how you're doing. You've done me a big thing. Miss. This guy's really easy, hey. He, he talks like, uh... You know, this guy talks like, you know, the coach in Rocky IV. Everything's around, go hit, he destroys! Okay, anyway. <laughs> Jill! Hey, answer me. God damn it. 
Nick dropping the 50 stars as well. Thank you again, sir. Jill's been we got thank you screen going out to Duran and Nick. Maybe Dr. Bart You're doing good. Good to hear, man. I'm happy to hear that. He sounded like Drago's manager. You know, kind of, sort of that, anyway. <laughs> you hang in there, super cop. I got you. Did, did I get the classics for Jill and Carlos? I do have the classics. I haven't used them yet. I might do them in a future playthrough. It'll give me a reason to stream the game again. You're probably going to see me stream this game on the monthly after we beat it. I love this game. This is, uh, it's fa uh, this has just been an amazing Resident Evil experience. Oh, Army G Gaming just said you became a paid supporter. Man, God bless. Thank you very much as well. Holy shit. Do me a favor, US Army Veteran Gaming. It showed your personal page name. Oh, I see. Let me have a look. There we go. I, I won't I won't repeat your name uh, unless your real name unless you want me to but thank you very much US Army guy gaming I really appreciate that don't forget to message me and use all your perks all right so uh, don't forget to give me a retro request for whatever Wednesday we'll play your game on our show and uh, man thank you for being a sponsor so we got a big thank you going out to US Army guy gaming uh, to Nick and to Duran this one's going out to you guys. Yeah. Oh, I think I think everything's a okay there for me, Dex. I think he looks great. All right, so let me just pick up some stuff in here. Is there anything in this uh, room? So now this is this is where I got up to last night, guys. The hospital. Um, it wasn't it to the point where I was lost, but uh, it was. You know, this is a little bit. This is a little bit tricky. The hospital, guys. It does slow down the action a little bit. Uh, hopefully that will not be the case today, but. Um, you know, guys, all I'm going to say is keep your eyes peeled. I'm probably going to need uh, your help in this game uh, now more than ever from this point. So here we go. We're going to go out here. You love Major Pain? Uh, how good is Major Pain, man? 100%. <laughs> so we're just going to look for everything. Where's Bard now? Got to be the lab in the back. Stay frosty. I'm on my way. Copy. I'll go on ahead. So you can, as you can imagine, hospitals are really big. We need bolt cutters for that. It'd be like, I've got bolt cutters in the chest, don't I? I don't think... Oh, there's, there's, there's like a first aid spray and some bullets over here, apparently. Alright, here we go. So we've got the first aid spray and some bullets. Alright, so I'm just going to quickly go back in here. No. I want to go back in this room and just pull this... Uh, as I said, I'm just trying to stay as light as possible because I know we're going to have to carry a lot of ish. There we go. Okay, now we can go to the next part. Oh, my man, that is much too big. Let me just pause the game for a second. US Army Veteran Gaming says, This is to help your channel uh, keep up the awesome... Man, that's a lot of zeros. Man, thank you very much. US Army Veteran Gaming with a thousand stars. And, uh, man, honestly, it doesn't matter if it's one star or a million. They all add up and help us. And um, it's people like you that manage to keep us on the air full time. You know, I hate that I rely on you guys so much. Uh, but we are crowdfunded. And um, that's incredible, man. Thank you. This is going out to you. And you know what? I think we need to have a beer, sir. Thank you very, very, very much for your generous donation, my man. We got to, uh, yeah, you go. We we need we need to go to the Boston uh, pub and have a real beer one day, I think. I don't got time for this. I'm hoping we can turn some lights on in here, eh? <laughs> we do. We definitely need to turn some lights on. Oh damn! Okay, we well. And oh my goodness, this is turning into another Haley's comment here today. Um, oh, bro, you 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 need to you need to put that wallet away, my man. You're gonna put my future kids, heaven forbid, any chick's gonna want to touch me through college one day. 
U.S. Army guy veteran with another uh, 1,200 stars. Thomas with 50. And uh, Josh with 50 as well. You guys are awesome. <laughs> Oh, I've forgotten his name off the top of my head. Carlos is evil boss, basically, Captain BS. Carlos is evil boss. Keep forgetting his name. Nikolai, or whatever his name is. Thank you so much, guys. Once again, you're turning me into, as I said, I always use this analogy, but you're turning me into those, like, spoiled 16-year-olds on MTV. You know those girls that are on, like, My Sweet 16th? I always say it, guys. You know those girls that always complain that you know, they got like a, like a Toyota Corolla instead of like a Cadillac. Like, ma'am, I wanted a bigger car. You know, you you got you guys are almost spoiling me as much as those chicks. <laughs> so what's that? We need to go back to that lock later on. All right, we've got these other doors coming up. All right, so far so good. I mean, we're not lost yet. <laughs> can we go in here? We can. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. Every everyone's gonna make fun of me for like coughing. I can assure you, I don't have the my Sharona yet. And Billy says, "Ricky, thanks for all you do, man. It's my absolute pleasure, sir. My absolute pleasure. Thank you very much, Billy, for the fifty. We're gonna use this radio to get through." But we need a cassette tape first, so all right, we're gonna find that bad boy. Billy, this is going out to you. Thank you for the 50 stars, my man. And Kevin says, if you keep this up, you might be a booby stream before you know it. I I, I did flash my. I, I, this is not one of my finest moments, but uh, I did flash my breasts for a, a couple uh, star donations uh, earlier in the week. Uh, I'd rather not talk about it, but it happened. <laughs> well, it wasn't my finest hour. The new Halloween game. We're getting a Halloween game. By the way, guys, I saw a lot of uh, beta reviews uh, for the new Predator game, and unfortunately, the feedback was not all that positive. I don't know if you guys have seen it for yourself, but yeah, a lot, a lot of the feedback was was not so great. Alright, so there's like an emergency entrance there. I don't know if there's anything important in this room. I think there might be some items we need in here. I'm just having a quick look. Don't forget, if the rooms are still red... Oh, there we go. That means there's items you still need to pick up. I don't know. I think we'll, we'll be okay. Can we go this way? Alright, fantastic. No dramas. I'm wondering if we should go up the stairs yet. I think we got to unlock that door from the other side, so we're going to do that in a minute. So, is it like a... Yeah, I've been curious, because didn't Dead by Daylight have a Michael Myers skin or something? Yeah, it was, Nic it was Nikolai. It was like Carlos's boss or commander-in-chief or whatever. You know, that other... That other, uh... Evil mercenary. You have to make sure he's dead. You can never be too careful in this cheese. Anything over here at this point? No. Hey, gone, Russell. Wonderful to see you, sir. Doing all right, man. We're about thirty minutes ahead of where we were this time yesterday when we played this game. So, second playthrough has been a lot quicker. I feel like I'm definitely benefiting here from the practice today. Timmy dropping the 100 stars as well. Timmy, welcome back. How is your break? Man, as I said, uh, much love to you, Timmy. I hope you're staying safe in New York City right now. And um, I'm going to put some things away. Hang on. We're going to open this bad boy up. Uh, we probably just put that away for now. Good to see you, Timmy. Timmy, thank you for the 100 stars. And uh, what are we going to give to Timmy before we go? Timmy, this is, uh... Where is it? Where's my job? This is for you, Timmy. And you took my job! <gasps> he took his job! He took it, girl! He took it! 
<laughs> yeah, guys, speaking of which, please don't forget to check out US Army Guy Veteran... Uh, sorry, US Army Veteran Gaming. Gosh, man, I screwed that up again. Sorry, brother. Um, don't... You know what I mean? It's always good to support the people that support us, and I'm not on 24 hours a day. So uh, definitely check out all the other uh, awesome streamers in our community, guys. And no, I feel you. Well, we'll probably see you more often, Army Veteran Gaming, because we're on at 9am every morning now, except for Sunday. So that might be a good uh, opportunity to catch up a little bit more. But yeah, I'm now on every morning. Uh, well, I'm on Tuesday to Saturday at 9am, and Commodore's on on uh, a Monday. Man, this is a bit of a mess, hey? This needs a good clean. We need a lockpick from here somewhere. Now, that's what I wasn't able to manage to find last night, the lockpick. How, how do we open this door? So I've got to remember where the key is. The key to the locker room is in the court. Oh. oh! Okay, so we got to go the... How do we get to the courtyard again? The key, the key to... Okay. So what's this over here? Simple lock. Lock door. Oh, that's right. We've got to jump off the balcony. Which sounds a little bit savage, but... Uh, I think I know where we need to go. Yeah, man, I know what you mean, bro. I wish I could support a lot more people, too. Like, um... The, 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 the time restraints and everything is definitely a real thing, isn't it? There we go. So I think we need to just jump down here and go in this courtyard. Alright, fantastic. And if I'm not mistaken, there should be a, a, a key card on the ground around here somewhere. What's this bad boy? Oh, there we go. We've got a tactical grip. Well, fantastic. So this is pretty much where we got up to last night, guys. We are almost uh, in uncharted territory here now. There we go. Boom. We got the key. And uh, we can now go back in that upstairs area. Fantastic. And I think this... Uh, Man, we ain't we ain't running out of this uh, ammo in a hurry. This is great. And uh, I think all we need to do is go back upstairs now. So Sandblaster Gaming says I'm trying to complete this today, guys. I'm going to give it my absolute best shot. I'm going to do everything in my power to beat this game today. If I get stuck, I get stuck. But. Uh, as I said, guys, I promised you a show, and that's what you're getting. <laughs> As I said, you know, we've improved. Uh, like, we're a half an hour ahead of yesterday. Fuckity, what the hell? Was that a liquor? I, I just saw something over there. I don't know what it is. I think we're going to see some hunters soon, actually. So this key is going to unlock this door over here. A little bit of backtracking, not too much. <clears throat> and uh, all right, we're going to throw that key away. Yeah, bargainy. And I think there's going to be the key card that's going to unlock all the private doors. You see anything in there? Nothing really important. Oh, hello. Maybe it's in this one. Boom, there we go. Hospital ID card. And that is it. I think that's... Uh... Now, we'll just have a look one more time. There's apparently something we need in the staff room, but I can't see it anywhere. Or maybe it's just that. Uh, we oh gosh, apparently we're leaving something behind in here. Oh, it's just that locker room, that's right. Okay, now we gotta come back later on with a lockpick. Wherever the bloody hell that is. Um, alright. So let's check out some of these other doors. Hey, 
Austin, absolutely, man. I'm trying to beat the whole game today. I'm dedicated, sir. As I said, I think the only two areas we got left after this, if it's anything like the original, is the clock tower and the underwater treatment plan. I don't, I don't, I don't, I... Fuck it, dude! Shoot him! Those hunters are no joke, eh? Yeah, Jesus Christ is right. Oh my gosh. Man, that's freaking nuts. <laughs> so we're just going to check out these other two... Uh, okay, we can't go in this door. No, we can. Oh, we haven't been in here yet. Well, there we go. We got the nurse's station. Lucky I checked, huh? Alright, well, let's, let's have a look around in this bad boy right now. Can we, can we open that door? No, that door won't open. So there's a safe here. I don't know what the safe code is for that one. Uh, ever watch Falling Skies? I don't know what that is, actually. Yeah, the, the, the Predator Mouth. It's pretty similar, isn't it? I actually don't think we've been to this area before. I think this is brand new. I don't think I got this far last night. Oh my gosh. Take that, Tiffany. Yeah, we still need the bloody lockpick, though, man. Oh gosh. Josh says, everyone go and give Ami Veteran Gaming a like and a follow. Yes, please. Absolutely. Please do so, guys. You'd be doing him a service and you'd be doing me a service as well. So, we just unlock this other door. By the way, Joshy, this is for you. America! <laughs> Thank you again, Brosef. <clears throat> what's, what's over on this one? Some more ammo... This looks like a whole new, um... Oh no, we just jumped off there before, didn't we? We've been in here yet? No, we just did a big circle. Okay, whatever. Alright, we're just gonna, we're just gonna... What's this over here? What was that? Safe? If someone can find the safe code for the hospital, that would save me a hell of a lot of time. Because I have a feeling there's probably like a quest item in there. I don't know if anyone can Google the safe code for the hospital Resident Evil 3 Remake. But that would be really, really handy if, if, if someone's got the information. Saves us... Might save us 5 or 10 minutes, you know? Just just an idea. No, 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 no obligation, of course. Safe number is nine and three. That's only part of the safe number. Oh, so we're back in the nurses' room. So this, okay, so there's. Oh gosh. Well, we've, we've done everything in here according to the map. Is it really nine three seven for this safe? You legend. Let's try it. No, nine three seven was for the first safe. That's for the first safe in the game. No, it's not 937. That's the first safe in the game. I, I didn't... You have to be specific. That's, a, that's the... Um, the Aqua Cure safe. That's in the start of the game. Uh, okay, I, think, I don't think there's anything else we can do up here right now. I think we need to go downstairs. So, we got to come back up here later. James says try 69 or 420. Sorry, James, fuck off. Thomas says 835, thank you. Hospital, safe 3, JK, hospital 2F, 9, left, 3, right. Yep, yeah, that's only 2, you need 3, you need 3 numbers. You need, you need 3 numbers, guys. Yeah, Thomas says 835, you know what, let's just try it. Ah, oh, damn, I pressed the wrong thing. 8, 3... 
No, that wasn't it, Thomas. Are you guys just pulling numbers out of your asshole? Billy says 9 and 3. So is it really just 2? 9? 9 and then 3. Is it really just 2? Wow, okay. Sorry, guys. I didn't mean to... So it really is 9 and 3. Okay. I, I thought it was weird that it was only 2. My bad, everyone. I feel like a really bad friend now that I didn't believe anyone. I'm, I'm, I'm a real dick. Alright, well, we did it, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you. All good. I was just really surprised it was only two digits. <laughs> it's alright, guys. I'm a dick. It's all good. I didn't believe anyone. I'm a bad friend. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm sorry. You forgive me? Alright, here we go. We're gonna go out this, uh... <laughs> but, yeah, no, I appreciate it. It was. It was just a very big surprise to me that it was only two digits. So let's see what else we got. We've got a couple other doors over here I think we can unlock. Um, so let's, let's go over on this side. Yeah. It's a new area. So here's, here's this one. Alright, cool. Operating room. <clears throat> <laughs> Some Bishami knowledge for the win, yes sir, absolutely. Oh, here you go, got to go on Herb Crazy here. I'm running out of inventory space. This is a real problem. Ooh, that's kind of disgusting. Handgun ammo. We've got no room for the handgun ammo, even if we wanted it. Oh, we don't need that card key anymore. Oh, that's all gone. I don't really want that grenade. We need to free up some room. No, I'm not going to pick up the handgun stuff for now. What's this? More assault rifle ammo. That's what's important. It's flash grenade, grenade, grenade. So, I don't know. Is there any ammo in this? Or is there actually something like... We need to find like a... We're trying to find a cure for Jill, don't forget, guys. So we need to find a cassette tape for this cassette tape player. Let me, let me just go here. We, we, we're looking for a cassette tape to put in here with a doctor. A player for audio cassette tapes, you'll have to put a tape in it for it to work. Okay, so I don't think there's anything we need in this room. We've got the emergency entrance over here. I don't know where else to go. Oh, I'm, I'm a little bit stuck now. See, this is where we got stuck last night. Can we go in here anyway? Is there like a... I don't know if there's a way to break this open or not. No, we can't. Okay, good, good, good luck with that, Rick. Um, oh, let's just go back over here quickly. You guys are on a big delay. Everyone that's still giving me the... Oh my gosh, you guys are delayed to the shithouse right now. So yeah, we need the cassette tape for that, and we can't go in there. Sesame. No voice found. I don't know where the cassette tape... Oh gosh, I'm... this is where I'm getting stuck. So, Kyle says, go back to the safe and get the contents. I got the content. Guys, you're on a... De oh, my gosh. Everyone's on a freaking delay. It's killing me. We need the lockpick as well. I wonder if we have to go back and get the lockpick off Jill. Maybe we need to go back to the chest. Let's have a quick look. Maybe maybe we can get the lockpick off Jill. I don't know, guys, because I'm freaking stuck. So, so Curtis says, push through. I'm pushing through. Let's just go. I'm going to put some stuff away and retrace trace my steps from the beginning. It's all good. Can we get anything off Jill? No, we can't. We can't. Okay, so let's have a look at what's in here for now. Where's, where's this chest at? So where, where's the chest at? Is it just out? Oh, here it is. Alright, so, um... Can you have a look? Is there like a... No. I'll put that away. Put that away. 
that away. All right, we're going to save while we're here, and we're going to retrace our steps. Watching from YouTube, there's two hunters by the nurse's station. James is right, it's in that room. James is right about what? I'm trying to catch up. No, you... What, what did James just say? Safe downtown after... Okay. You, got, you guys are on a big delay. The cassette tape is in the treatment room, Oliver says. Is it really? So where's, where's the treatment room at? So we're going to go back upstairs. I don't know how I missed it. Alright, guys. So I keep missing the cassette tape in the treatment room. Alright, that's fine. We can go We can go back to the treatment room. No big deal. Maybe you can use a grenade to blow that... You know, that actually makes a lot of sense in theory. Uh, I, I can't argue with that. That does make a lot of sense. So we got to go back upstairs to the treatment room. Again, I do apologize, everybody. This is, this is just as much frustrating to me. <laughs> we're going to pull, we're gonna, we're gonna pull that uh, treatment room apart. Oh, here we go. Use the hunters to kill the, the grenade to kill the two hunters and grab the tape. You guys, I don't know who's on a delay and who's not. That's why I'm not following any advice. It's not that I don't believe you guys. Where, where, where's the other... Oh, my God. Where's the treatment room again? I've completely forgotten where it is. Oh, dude, I'm... Oh, hold up. Wait a minute. Nurse station, sick room, roof. Curtis says, take your time, dude. I'm trying. There's a few people on Facebook nagging at me at the moment. Treatment room. Where is I can't find it anywhere. Make your way towards the linen room. Okay, linen room. So linen room is... Um, where's the linen room? It's just over here. Nick sick room, staff room. Where is the linen? Oh, here it is, over here. Simple. All right, linen room. Okay. We can do that. There's like a door there that we haven't been in yet, apparently. All right, we got this. You have to fight the two hunters, get the grenades. I'm not going to go all the way back downstairs to get the grenades now. We're just going to use the machine gun. In the room right after the linen room. Okay, no worries. So we're going to work out how to get in this... Um... So there's the other room over here. Where, where's this other door at? There's like a door in here that I haven't been in yet. It's not there. Where is it? Is it this side? This one. Oh, okay. Okay, new room. How did I miss that? It doesn't matter now, does it? We got him. Says you need... It's alright, we got this. kidding me oh, oh that's frustrating I didn't even realize I was low health I had plenty of health items too Alright, let's see where we are. We're probably going to go back downstairs. Alright, well, we may as well grab a grenade, huh? 
Damn it, we have to go. I hate myself so much sometimes. Oh my gosh. Alright, here we go. I don't have any grenades in here, and I think there's a grenade upstairs. Oh, here we go. We do have one. Alright, so, alright, we've got one grenade to use. Let's go back up. Damn it, I c Can we not all be know-it-alls, please? The, the etiquette with backseat gaming is if I'm asking for help, then you give help. You don't start being a Terry know-it-all, or whatever it's called. My gosh. You too, too much backseat gaming takes the fun out of streaming. Especially some bitches that have never played the freaking game yet. Alright, here we go. We're gonna go over here. Where are we gonna go over here? This side. Alright, we're gonna go back up here. No, we can't do that yet. How you going, Kenya? I love this game. We're a little bit stuck in the hospital now, but we're almost done. I do have some health items, I just forgot to use them. We're fine. Okay, so this is going to take us up to the stairway. <clears throat> Thank you, James. Appreciate it. Okay, so back to the linen room. Marco says keep it up. Thank you, Marco. Marco dropping the 50 stars. I will, bro. We got this. It's alright, man. A little bit of a hiccup, but we got this. <laughs> Thank you so much for the 50 stars, Marco. Norris, Kevin, you have a great sleep, huh? Again, Kevin, thank you for hanging out today. So how, how do I get to the linen room? We have to... Oh. We have to go the long way around. That's fine. Marco, I'll be right with you, sir. I don't have a grenade launcher with Carlos right now. Jill has a grenade launcher, Carlos doesn't. I've only got the handgun, the machine gun, and a grenade. This one's gone out to you, Marcus. Thank you so much. Marco, sorry. Nearly picks me up. This guy hits so hard and fast. Alright, so here we go. So this um So this uh There we go, we got one. I mean, that, that, that... Oh, dude, you see... There's zombies in here at Varkity! Alright, well, at least we got one hunter. I was still on fine, apparently, according to this. Right. Is there a fair amount... Oh, on this difficulty, there is. Definitely on this difficulty, there is. At least we blew up one of them with a grenade. Oh, we did it this time. Got it. All right, here we go. Assault rifle ammo. Finally, we got that cassette tape. Jeez, man, about freaking time. Well, you know what? At least we're not going to get stuck on this bit of the game ever again. That's for damn sure. That was that was a hard learning curve, guys, but we did it. Let's combine this. We can go in that other room downstairs. Thank you guys, appreciate that. Sorry, sorry for my impatience, everyone. I just, uh, yeah, I was just a little bit overwhelmed there for a second. You know, um, go back downstairs now. I think that's all. Oh crap! I think we can take the shortcut. We're gonna avoid that hunter. <laughs> I forgot there's a shortcut, but sometimes the best strategy is just to not be there, right? Right, we're out. Man, there's too many of these fuckers. So, so where's this room? Is this the... That's a padlock door. That's a voice door over here. Um, okay, we can... We're almost there.
I knew they were going to bust open sooner or later. You could just see that happening, couldn't you? You totally see that coming. Oh, gosh. It didn't even get... I didn't get any time to freaking reload. Oh, bro. Just wreck off. Oh, we got him. How are we going for... Alright, let's just use that health item. So that, that's that voice... No, that's not the voice operated door. What's, what's in this uh, little thing? There we go, some handgun ammo. Not that that's going to really help us out at the moment, but you know, whatever. <clears throat> they really need to use the remake of Resident Evil 1 using this engine. I don't think they're going to remake Resident Evil 1 again anytime soon. I think they're going to do Code Veronica and maybe number 4. All I wanted to know was what the documents were doing in your office. Thank you, Captain place. BS. Appreciate that. So, Jonathan says, bar. Good night, bro. You're going to work in the morning. No worries, Jonathan. We'll see you next time. Hey, thank you again for coming in. Of course. Well, um, yeah, we're gonna, as I said, I'm doing my absolute best uh, to get right through to the end of this today. It's important to me that we beat this, sumbish. We, we gotta beat this on release day. Bard. Tyrell. Bard's dead. He's been shot. Shit. And the vaccine? I'm looking. Well, look harder. There's gotta be a computer, right? The doctor ain't looking too healthy, unfortunately. Oh, here we go. So this is like Windows 95 over here. Just use the old Windows 95. This is VRC Chief Nathaniel Bard. September 29, 11 p.m. I am acutely aware that my time's running out. And I hope and pray by making this recording and bringing the truth to light that I can restore some small shred of honor to my name. Ooh. All of Raccoon City's suffering began with the release Guys, of if you haven't smashed the like phones. button yet, guys, that would really, really help us out, don't forget. We're almost on 300 likes, which is an uh, incredible thank you, everybody. They ordered my team to develop a vaccine, which we did. Now, I keep I'm glad you're all still watching. I know it's getting really late. I think in another uh, 30 minutes. Oh wait, is it Pacific time? That I, th I think you guys are about an hour and a half from the digital release of this, actually. You, you, when, when, when games get released in the United States, you go by Pacific time, don't you? Steve dropping the 100 stars. Thank you, Steve. I know they don't want me to... Yeah, I, I, have you ever watched those like old school Teen Reacts videos? They're they're always really really funny, aren't they? Steve, this is for you, sir. Thank you again for the support. She trusted me anyway. Fuck! Look, it looks like whatever vaccine we need's probably in this. Uh, April mentioned door over here. I think there's like a, a first aid spray here too. Hold up, wait a minute. Well, there's a herb. <clears throat> Is it here? Looking for the vaccine. There we go, guys. We got it. We can make Jill all better. Give the vaccine to Jill. We will indeed. Right, Hang tight. We're going to go rescue our girlfriend. T, I got it. Be careful. Careful? <laughs> Have you seen this town? Yeah, I mean, if, it, if, if it's on the internet, it must be true. It's just one of those things, huh? <laughs> if it's on the internet, it must be true. Believe everything you hear on the internet. Okay. Our, 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 the, the number one strategy is just to not be there. There'll be a hunter come around this corner. Oh, wait, he can follow you? I did not realize this. All right. Gosh, that 
wasn't pleasant. Now what? We, w we went too far. This door. Alright, cool. And just like that, I think, my friends. You're gonna be okay, Joe. Oh, we got this. Oh, Curtis says all new games are Eastern time dropped. Oh, at least that's a little bit more fair. Cool. I just, I just uh, had to crack open another soda. I've got these uh, creaming soda Pepsi Maxes here. The caffeine's what's keeping me going today. Hi, Ralph. What the hell happened? Attention all citizens. The contagion spreading throughout the city has been designated uncontainable. On October 1st, Raccoon City will be completely destroyed in a missile strike. All residents capable of rational thought are urged to evacuate immediately. This is not a test. Attention all citizens. <clears throat> I mean, that's only a day away. So Richard says now you can pick the There's locks? The city. Oh, because we're Sam using Jill. Fuck. Here they come. Oh, you sit tight. I got this. Wait, did I just get a lockpick? Hang on, defend Jill. I, I, I guess we better save very quickly. That, that'd probably be a good idea. You think I should have Red Bull instead? Yeah, Red Bull's probably better for me, isn't it? Actually, no, it's not. What am I talking about? Red, Red Bull's not healthy at all. What am I going on about? There you go. Here's these... Uh, So we got to defend Jill. All right. So what's what's that entail? Does that mean we just got to go outside and shoot some stuff? I'm gonna try to lower the window shutters. The less entry points, the better. And how do we do that? I'll try hacking into the hospital security system. Keep them off me in the meantime. It looks like we got a survival level. This is a nice little uh. Eden, thank you so much. Wow, man, that's a lot of zeros. <laughs> Thank you, Eden. I, I, I am, I am, I am fading a little bit, Eden. But I'm not going anywhere. I'm so determined to beat this game today. It's not funny, Eden. Thank you for your generous donation. This is going out to you. <laughs> Thank you, Eden. Oh, man, that's incredible. Thank you so much. So what, we're just going to sh shoot as many zombies as... What's over here? It's like something on this table over here. I don't know what that is. A detonator. A detonator to use with C4 explosives. Okay, well, I do... Don't know where the C4 explosives is. Can you see the C4 anywhere? I, I do not see any C4 here, guys. I mean... I mean, there's a detonator here. Can you see the C4? I can't find the plastic explosive. I mean, so far, so good. I just, uh... I don't know. Can you see any plastic explosive here anywhere, guys? That would make life, uh, very... I'm gonna wait for these things to come over here and we can shoot this little thing there. James says it's too funny. Yeah, man, sometimes we get a little bit creative here. What can I say? <laughs> sometimes. I'm glad we stockpiled all this freaking machine gun ammo now. We definitely need it, huh? This is, uh, you only got so much ammo. Well, there we go. Some more rounds. I can't see the C4 there anyway. No, I really mean it, Eden. Thank you. It's, um, it, it all really, really helps us out. Oh, 
Well, the lights just went off. Oh, come on. Find the breaker, it must be. Why, why do I have to find the breaker for buckety, man? Where's the breaker at? How do I get the buckety? I don't know. What's this? Breaker switch is over here. Or at least it comes up on the map. Jesus. Oh, there's hunters in the What the buckety is that? Oh my gosh. Are we going to find the breaker switch over here, apparently? Oh, dude. Now what? I mean, at least there's a whole... Oh, now I'm out of ammo. Well, I mean, that's... Barkity! There's another hip thingy. Well, there you go. That's going to help us, I suppose. Barkity! Ah! Oh, my gosh. Get off me. Carlos, the Reese of Roof. Zip balls! Oh my gosh, we need to get up to the roof, apparently. How do I get to the roof? Oh gosh, I'm freaking... Well, if they're in the... Oh, buckety. How do I... There's not a whole lot I can do here. I can't go anywhere else. I'm just going to... Okay. What are we going to do? Defend Jill. That's all i got to do right now. Defend Jill. Alright, there we go. So we're gonna... I don't need to use any more health at the moment. We got, oh, gosh! This is crazy, man. I, I don't mind these survival levels. It changes the action for a little bit. N nice change of pace. I like that it's a bit more action-y. Gosh, what was that? Let's see if I can grab any more weapons quickly. He said room not... Oh, okay. That's what happens when you don't listen, I guess, Rick, huh? That's what happens when you... <laughs> oh, my gosh. Let's see, see if we can quickly use this grenade here. Oh my gosh, I need to use this. Come on, try to... <laughs> ah! Blow that hunter up! Fucking E, man. There we go, we got him. Jeez, bro. Here we go, take that, you zombie scum. This says, watch your back too. Yeah, I certainly need to, don't I? We got those zombie scumbags. I think we're almost done, guys. There, they've got the shutters in. The shutters are down. That was... I, I, okay. That's it. I think we got this. I think we're almost safe, guys. Oh, fuckity. The door as well. Okay. Oh, my gosh. I think we got some grenades here. Maybe you can knock the pillar down without... Explo oh, is, is the plastic explosives here? All right. There we go. Hold out until the explosion. Alright, here we go. Uh, that was a bit clumsy, wasn't it? Hang on, what we got now? Uh, here we got this. We probably should go in this room before everything explodes. Because I fire in the hole. Probably shouldn't be in there. Oh, that, that'll, that'll, that'll... Alright, well that was lucky, wasn't it? Yeah, they, 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 yeah, they delayed Last of Us again, so I don't think we're going to get it until, like, uh, probably the fall American time now. I think The Last of Us will probably come out the same time as Cyberpunk.
Vaccine's the real deal. All right, I'll be right back, guys. You going somewhere? You damn right. What do you think you're gonna do? Whole city's about to be microwaved. Come on, man. Call the government. Tell them we found a cure. You stall for time. Ballsy motherfucker. Oh, my control just fell off. There you go. It looks like Jill's A-OK -okay now. Whew. Jill. Oh. Oh, thank God you're okay. I've got good news. It's over now. The city's safe. Oh, shit. What's happened to Carlos? Oh, no! Oh, that sucks. You have to do it, Jill. You have to do it. You have to do it, Jill. I like Carlos, too, but you have to do it. Oh, she was dreaming. Oh. <laughs> Where am I? What's going on? Well, I don't, I don't understand. I don't understand what the first word means. Sorry, Drew. I think that was a typo. Attention, all citizens. The missile strike on Raccoon City will occur in just hours. The payload is designed to eradicate all biological material. You will not survive if you remain in the city. October first. Evacuate now. Repeat. No. Evacuate now. Can't be. So we need to start using the lockpick on everything now. So I think this now goes into the events after Resident Evil 1 now, doesn't it? Oh, hang on. Yeah, I, re I think... Yeah, hang on. I'm getting confused with the timelines now. I'm going to combine this. Just make sure we save. Yeah. We got this. So yeah, we're just gonna go all the locked doors now. So so much for removing a sex appeal. Jill's freaking beautiful in this one. Seriously. Not 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 being a typical you know creepy guy or nothing. But no, she's they, they did well with Jill on this. That's for damn sure. Morning, sunshine. You saved my life. I sure as shit didn't. That was all Carlos. He carried you here and he treated you himself. Crazy bastard. Where is he? He went underground. Borrowed stockpile of a vaccine, enough to give this city some hope. He thinks he can do this by himself. I'm going after him. Wait, did you see the broadcast? They're gonna blow the city sky high. I'm trying to get a hold of someone, anyone with the clearance to stop it. Leave this mess to him. He's a professional. So am I. Did I forget something important in that last room? I have a feeling there was some stuff here I need to take before we leave. There we go, so... So what, what? We got a new handgun here, so I don't know which one we should use. Yeah, you do a lot more damage in a short time. Alright, so we're just going to do one more thing over here. Put that away. Alright, fantastic. New, brand new gun. So, so we're just going to start finding all these uh, locks. All right, no problem. We're going to pick up that gunpowder now. No, I don't need any more at the moment. Maybe come back for that later. We'll try and keep this inventory free for now. Shot Jill, seriously. <laughs> Alright, um. That. Oh, wait, hang on. Here we go. We've got one door over here. <clears throat> yeah, 
I mean, they've changed a couple little things around in this, that's for sure. I have a funny feeling that's taken us to a different part of the game, so I actually just want to go around and get... No. I'm going to go up down here and upstairs and open these locks first, because I have a feeling we need to get, like, quests. I think that's taken us to the next part of the game. I, I think we need to get these uh, quest items first. So, I, th I think it's important that we go around here. Oh, nice, Austin. Thank you for letting me know. There we go. See, we, get, we have to get all important stuff like this. So, um... Where else we got? There's like a simple lock over here. I might not bother going upstairs. I might... I don't know. Should we... See how we go. We're just going to keep unlocking these little locks over here. Uh, this is this is now part of the game where it's sta starting to make you backtrack just a little tiny bit. Okay, so let's try out this lock. And I think there's like one more upstairs that we can grab. So explosive rounds. I mean, these are all obviously going to come in handy for later. So, I mean, I'm not... Oh, gosh, man. Really? Oh, thank God. What do we got now? Can we go up this way? All right. Uh... As I said, guys, we'll be out of here soon. I tell you what, the hospital's definitely my least favorite part of the game. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> I'm going to be very, very excited when this is over. So there's a simple lock over here and a simple lock over here. So we're going to get the stuffs. We're going to take it downstairs. We're going to save one more time. And uh, my friends, after that, we're done for good. We're out of here. Captain Bieso says those hunters come out of nowhere. Ah, uh, yeah, hell yeah, they do. If they leap at you, you they get a huge knockback using the shotgun. It's hilarious watching the hunters fly. Oh, well, here you go. You're about, you might see this sunbish happen again. There you go. We, we did all right, man. You know, with a shotgun, they only take two shots. So that's actually pretty decent. We ain't got no shortage of... Uh, Shotgun shells at the moment, so it's okay. There's that one. Oh, right, so there you go. I mean, that's all that effort for some more shotgun shells, but whatever. Right, so there's only one more lock up here, and then everything's 100% done. So, Matty says you're enjoying this game. It's pretty cool. I'm loving this game, too. I should kind of use this slower paced part just to have a breather, really. I should really just enjoy it, right? <laughs> I have, I'm having a feeling once we get out of this hospital, it's going to be absolute chaos again. And we, we, haven't, we haven't seen Nemi for quite a while. I'm sure Nemi's going to come back and be like, Hi, Jill. Hope you're having a great day very soon. So where, where's this uh, lock? Here she is. This is the last one. No worries, Steve. You have a great sleep, and man, thank you again for hanging out with us today. I appreciate you very much. So we got all these Magnum bullets. We haven't got the Magnum gun yet, though. All right, guys. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump downstairs, put all this Sunbish stuff away. And, uh, yeah, next area of the game coming up. How do we jump over? Well, this is where we're supposed to jump over, No. How do I get out of here? I'm going to leave that herb for now. How do we get out of here again? Oh, it doesn't matter. <clears throat> Alright, so where are we going to go now? This way. No worries, we're almost back to where we were. Uh... 
you know what, in hindsight, next time I play through this game, those locks are not necessarily all that important. I mean, eight magnum rounds are pretty handy, but I don't know if it's game-breaking on this difficulty to not have them. So, I mean, I honestly thought there'd be like a, like a hit pack or something in there for us. There's like a... Another, uh, there's a gunpowder there, but I'm not going to pick that up now. Alright, so here we go. We're going to put this away. We're going to save one more time. Oh, fantastic. Put that away. Put that away. Put that away. Oh, there's something else we don't need in here, apparently. Oh, we don't need the lockpick anymore. Well, they're not... Okay, cool. Fantastic. Next year we saved like 22 times. Wow, that's that's a bit, that's a, that's a little bit extreme, isn't it? You'd rather have it there and not need it than need it and not have it. You know what? I like that. You know that's that, that's a lot of common sense right there. I appreciate your way of thinking. All right, here we go. Finally, next part of the game. Russell says should have picked it up. You had room. Picked up what? Oh, that. No, it doesn't matter. You, you just never know, right? You just never know. Oh, this must be the way underground. It all looks pretty linear at the moment. Is this like an elevator we need to operate or something? And anything over here we need, perhaps? No. Josh says, better safe than story. See, I think so. <sighs> Alright, now what? How is it no one in the hospital ever noticed all this? You gotta use another elevator again? It's like Elevator Simulator 2020 Edition. Alright, well let's use this bad boy this time. Now what? Oh, and we just used the elevator to bring forth another elevator. Like, what the hell, man? <laughs> so, Timmy says on the first playthrough, he says, so it's not just me. Uh, I guess that's all done. Doesn't look like there's anything else we need either, so boom, out we go. Cool, another save, because you all know how much I love them. What's over here? There's like a, a hip pouch. Well, fantastic. If you encounter, as we've identified an issue with the electrical box where concurrent use of heavy machinery overloads it and it causes fuses to blow. If you encounter this problem and can't get the elevator running, please stay calm, gather the fuses from the sub generators situated around the warehouse and use those to restore power to the main generator as quickly as possible. All right, so uh, that, that means we got another puzzle coming up, obviously. All right, well, let's go. Oh, bro, this looks like a real big freaking room. How you going there, Pat? Nice to see you. Welcome, welcome. Can we shoot the sunbish in the head? Oh, he's behind glass. Well, that's a bummer. All right, well, let's, let's look around and see if we can find what we need. Yeah, see, we we need to we need to grab the fuses, obviously. So, all right. Well, let's find what we have a look at it for. What's this? Well, there you go. There's a fuse. Hunt for fuses. It's fuse number one. Oh wait, we need to find. Okay, no, that opens a fuse box. All right. Well. 
Let's, let's find the fuses. Can we, can we use this yet? No. Oh, hello. Is it regenerating? Is that going to take us up? No, she ain't working. All right. <clears throat> and so Pat says, am I using the PS4 today? Yeah, man, I'm using the... the oh, crap. Well, how else am I... Sp hang on. Oh, I see. This call called forth this area. Alright, no worries. Alright, this will take us to a new area. Okay, so here's a fuse over here. Well, that's fuse number one. There's three more to go. And, uh... You see me online? Yeah, man. We are, we, we're coming at you live right now, my friend. Fuse box. All right. Well, let's let's have a look down here and see what's up. Oh gosh, I don't think this is going to be too complicated. I think it's just a matter of hide and seek, really. Can't see anything in here, can you? Just going to make sure I don't move too quickly in case I miss something. No, I don't think there's anything in there. Let's have a look around over on this side. Oh gosh. Oh my, what the fuckity fuck is that all about? Alright, we're gonna have to pull out the shotgun. Oh my gosh. Where's this other one? Oh, we got both of them! Well, that worked. Uh, let me just look down. Oh gosh, now what? Okay, we can't go in there. What about on this side? This is... Oh, I did it. No, I think there's wait. something in there that we need, guys. I just have a funny feeling. Justin says you're, su you're such a punk when it comes to horror games, you have to buy this. <laughs> Okay, um... Did this take us back to the start? I don't know if that's doing any... Here we go, so this is a new area. I have a funny feeling there was something we needed over here first. Let me just go back in here. There was another elevator over here I think we need to do first. That shotgun is a beast. Yeah, we've added some extra parts to it. And, um, it's, it's certainly making a big difference. Okay, so we can go back in here in a minute. I think there's just... I think we need to go up this first. Is, is there anything in here? I thought we brought this down. Hmm. Okay, we're just looking for two more fuses. No, I thought we brought this down before. Maybe that's nothing. Alright, whatever. We're gonna go in here, guys. I'm sure this is going to take us to fuse number two. Let's see what's in this bad boy. Anything in here? No, just some ammo. It doesn't help that it's so dark, does it? What's this one? Lift lever. Oh, there's a door in here. I mean, this will take us somewhere we haven't been yet. I might need to go back to the, the handgun for a bit. What, what's this over here? Just some more shotgun shells. So at least we unlocked a door. What's what's over here? Uh, I don't know. You know what? I'm going to quickly save while we're here. This is going to take us to the office. So I'm going to very, very quickly save while we've got a fuse. 
You take care too, Pat. How much does it cost in Australia? This game? Oh, jeez. Um, $95 digitally. It's not cheap. Let's have a look around. I, 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 I'm not going to lie, guys. I am a little bit lost. Wait, have we done this one yet? Do we have to use this too? Oh, maybe we haven't used this one yet, have we? Alright, hang on. Oh, here we go. So, okay. So, so where's this going to take us now? Boy. I don't know. Is this a... Fuck, I'm so... I'm so fucking lost. Save open, no save states, no. Alright, keep looking, Rick. Be on the lookout for fuse... Oh, wait, there's another fuse over here. Well, there we go, there's another one. We gotta grab that. Alright, cool. Oh, we're gonna go back to the shotgun. There's too many of them. Oh, bro, get off me! Oh, damn, we gotta worry about that thing. T oh, shit balls, man. Alright, fuck, damn it. We were obviously on the right track because we got this sucker to take. Oh, I'm in trouble if we get stuck in here. Is he dead? Oh, gosh, we got lucky. Holy shit balls! Alright, so that, there you go, that's fuse number two. We only need one more. Hunt for fuses, I am hunting for fuses. What does it look like I'm freaking doing? Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, we gotta find one more fuse, guys. It will remind you of requests in Final Fantasy 15 that took hours to figure out. Well, guys, the good news is we only got one more to find. And, uh... Let's have a look in here. Wait, we were just in here before. What, weren't we? No nothing in here at the moment. Alright, well, I guess it doesn't hurt to go back. I don't think there's anything else in there. Gosh, man, just one more. Just one more, everybody, and it's all over. Let's have a look this way. This is, this is the way we came in, isn't it? Let's go back down. Hang on, no, we'll just go over here. Are you further? No, I'm way further than this morning. I only got Last night, I only got up to the hospital. We've left the hospital now. So this is all uh, uncharted territory. New area. Yeah, this is all uncharted territory now. We've done all that. Oh gosh, I don't know guys. <laughs> one more fuse, one more fuse. Oh, let's look, look back down on this end. No, see I can't get down here anyway. Maybe I need to go down that other ladder. I'm gonna go back on that other side, which we can do just by going through this room. No problem. You should, no you can only hold 20 at a time, so that's not gonna work. Uh, it won't make any more room. You can only hold 20 in a pack. So, you know, look at that. See, 19, 17. I combined them. This would still be here. Smarty pants. <laughs> okay, we must be going the right way because there's a hunter here. So, I mean, 
We'll go with that. If we can see a hunter, that means we're going the right way. Oh, there we go. There it is. We got them all, guys. Fuck yeah. That's it. Oh, my goodness. This is done. So how do we get back to the elevator? Where, where's, where's that fuse box? Fuse box, lift lever, lift lever. Lift lever, surveillance room. Where is it? The fuse box. So I'm trying to work out how to get back there. Oh my gosh. Okay, that, that's it. We're going to go up this ladder and around. Alright, we got them all, guys. Alright, we'll save before we go. That's it. We don't want to have to do all that again. <laughs> David says, glad you're still on, Rick. You're home from work and ready for chill a bit. Again, thank you so much, David. Appreciate that. David, this has gone out to you. Thank you for the 50 stars. Thank you, Captain BS. It's amazing what you can achieve when you don't let things stress you out for a change, huh? <laughs> now I'm just going to work out how to get back down here. I'll jump off. So I think the fuse box is just in this room. It is. Here we go. Alright, we are. I'm going to put all three of these sunbishes in. Alright, guys, we're done. Out. Oliver says you wish they would have added waypoints to the game. Most of the checkpoints are in this are pretty forgiving, but you can die in this certainly at tedious times, I've noticed. That's for damn sure. Man, I've been saving so much. I've been saving like a mofo today, seriously. Let's open this. Let's. What can we put away? We don't need that now. Don't need that now. That'll do. So we're going to pursue, pursue Nikolai, and uh, I don't know where he's gone exactly. Is it de over here, I guess? So, so how do we use that part? Oh, wait, was, or is that the way we came in? That must be the way we came in. What? Well, I, I don't know what we're... So... Where we, where, where, oh, wait, he's in here maybe somewhere. I don't know. So I, I found all these parts of the Magnum. I have a feeling I missed a gun because we haven't picked it up yet. Where, where are we supposed to go in here? Can you see? Maybe we could use this computer. I don't know. Here we go. Tyrell's about to die, isn't he? I got through. They're willing to negotiate. I remember, didn't Tyrell die in the hospital in, in number three, if I'm not mistaken? They'll call up the strike if, and this is one. He's about to get a bullet in his head, I think. Deliver the vaccine to them before they launch. How long do we have? Hours, maybe. Then let's not waste one more second. This way. <clears throat> We'll find the vaccine up ahead. Oh, gosh. Big thank you again for hanging out, guys. If you're new in here, guys, I wanted to say a big welcome once again to OneCoin only. Um, we stream every single day from 7 p.m. in the mornings at 9 a.m. as well. And uh, we do new games. We also do retro stuff as well, like Mario and all that kind of thing, too. I got your back. And, uh, you know, obviously right. we just like to, to play cool started. games, have a good hangout, good time. Everyone's a little bit quiet because it's getting late, but we, there's usually a lot more chit-chat in here. Where's Chris Redfield in this game? Where was Chris Rez Redfield in this time? I think he was overseas, wasn't he? In the, at this point in the game, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, he's screwed. No. Go. 
Should have known that was coming, huh? Yeah, shit is right, Jill. Shit is damn right. <laughs> oh my gosh. Eliandro says, how's the game so far? I thought up until we got to the hospital was perfect. The hospital was a little bit tedious, but still fun. Um, overall, I think this game is incredible. I love it. I, I do prefer this over number two remake. Um... You know, it's, it's not perfect, but it's it's great. Really, really digging it. We need to find, like, a handprint for that or something. All right. We gotta go up there yet? No, we'll go up there later. High grade gunpowder. You know what I'm thinking we're going to do, guys? I'm actually going to put the shotgun away for a little while. That away for a little while. That away for a little while. I'm actually going to pull out... Um, that. What are we going to pull out? I actually want to use... Um, I think it's getting to the point of the game where I want to start using... Uh, your assault rifle. Yeah. We're going to use that. We're going to take out all this assault rifle ammo now. Because, you know, why not? Let me see what else we got here. Just give me a sec. I think, I think we got all the ammo that we got. Oh, no, hang on. There it, is. there it is. Another 200. And, um... Yeah, that'll, that'll be us for now. Just the one gun. We'll just use the assault rifle for a minute. <clears throat> You think the mag is in the... You th it doesn't matter. It's too late now. We can't go back. So I think we can beat the game without the magnum as well, thanks to the difficulty level that we're on. So what we need to do is go back out the store, up the stairs. Once once we're out of bullets in this gun, we'll pull out the shoddy again. Oh, we'll go this way first. that Oof. oh come on oh my gosh you really that bad a shot Jill I think she is you have a good idea for a star screen yeah man send it our way you know I'm always down for new content Um, I know guys, I don't know what we need to do in here or not. There's like vaccines in here or something, apparently. To begin vaccine synthesis, place so we're gonna the find the vaccine. The synthesis? I have to make it myself? <sighs> Alright, All right, so most efficiently to synthesize a vaccine both and... We need an antigen. And an adjuvant. So we gotta we got find the stuff. Alright, wherever that is. So good luck with that, Rick. What's this over here? Override key. Oh, so we can go. Okay, so we can go back to that area downstairs. Override key removed. We got some kind of USB stick. I don't know where we use that exactly, but I'm sure we'll figure that out soon. Alright, cool. Good to see you, Jeremy. Thank you for coming in. What's my verdict on this overall? Man, I, I love the start of this game, because the start of this game was just so incredibly fast-paced. And uh, now that we're on, like, the second part of this game, it's still great. But I feel like they've just slowed down the action just a little bit too much. For my my liking, but um, the, the the first two and a half hours of this was a non-stop thrill ride. It was incredible. I'm sure it's going to end very strong as well. I just don't like how they've broken up the action so much at the moment. 
Because we've been spending the last, what, hour, hour and a half running around in a bunch of circles. How you going, Chef Jonesy? Good to see you, Aussie, Aussie, Aussie. Maybe I gotta use this. Maybe, maybe I gotta use that here. Oh, here we go. Gotcha. Well, there we go. So now what we're going to do is find the vaccine ingredients from in here. Hey, you going, Umberto? Thank you very much for coming in. Big shout out to our friends from Naples. Hope you're doing fantastic. Curtis says, conserve ammo won't last long. I'm okay, man. As I said, we got so much shotgun and grenade gun ammo. I'm deliberately using this machine gun now. But I'm trying, man. I'm not going to try and be, like, pistol happy if I can help it. You know, just certain things like not wanting to get eaten and stuff. Oh, an antigen sample. I'll definitely need this for the vaccine. Wonder if we get to use Carlos again. So now what? What's this? Shotgun shells. Alright, fantastic. Now what's this? A handgun. So I don't know where else to go now. Let's look at this map. Well, there's like a downstairs area that we haven't been in apparently. Hang on. No, we got everything we need from here. Alright, well we got part one of this vaccine, whatever it is. Andrew says, good job so far. Thank you, bro. I'm trying to hang in there. <laughs> I, I, I dare say we must be getting very close to the end of this game. Although we haven't done the clock tower yet. I have a funny feeling the clock tower is probably the last area. Alright, so where, where do we go now? There's like a door up the back that we haven't used yet, so we're going to try and get to this door up the back. I'm guessing that's got the other thing that we need. Alright, cool, no problem. The adjuvant samples are stored in the incubation lab, which I'm guessing is just downstairs, so no problem. Do I like the remake of this or the original? I think for the most part... I prefer the the remake over the original of Resident Evil 3. Just for the just for the first half of the game alone, it was just such a thrill ride. Like the fir the first two and a half hours of this game is incredible. Let's have a look here. This must be what powers it. All right, now what? Nick says I'm doing a good job. Yeah, man, I'm hanging in there. Thank you, brother. Just ke just keeping calm, keeping my focus. So, so what do I got to do over here? Press any of these buttons? Chef Jonesy says the original Resident Evil 2 is still one of your favorite P PlayStation games. Yeah, I, th I, I, I think that's still the best one. I think that e e that still holds up even today. Is the game short? It's only about six hours, apparently, Alejandro. But there's also a multiplayer, like, game included as well. I've forgotten what it's called. I think it's called Resident Evil Resistance or something. There's like a... I haven't tried it out yet, though, so I can't tell you too much about it. But yeah, this isn't just a single player game. You've got the multiplayer mode and all that gimmicky stuff. Thomas says, run, Rick, run. I am some bish. <laughs> As I said, what we need to find is this incubation lab, according to the game. Which is probably just over on this side. 
Don't forget, guys, it's not too late to share if you know any fans of Resident Evil or any gaming groups. Likes and shares are very much appreciated, guys. Best way you can help us out, 100% for free. Thomas says, careful, Nemesis is on the way. He probably is. He's, he's probably not too far off. What's in this bad boy? What's this? So it's called the Nemesis. Uh, I have a feeling what we need is in this room. No, not that one. I don't know. Anything in here we can grab? Well, oh, here we go. Here it is. Oh, fantastic! An adjuvant sample. These are combined. With now, the now we can finally measurement. make this thing and move on. So what? Is there a shortcut, or do we have to go all the way back? I guess we have to go all the way back. We got this, guys. Out we go. You have to forgive me, guys. I've got, like, the bladder of, like, a... Man, I, I need to pee so much today. I'm holding it in for as long as possible. I thought... Not that anyone cares about my bladder movements. I'm just sharing that. Okay, we're gonna have to use this. Oh, get off me, freaking hunter! Oh gosh, dude! For fuck's sake, please tell me I got a checkpoint here. No, I'll wait a little bit longer. Nick says you pee all the time. Welcome to 40. <laughs> My gosh. I hope we're checkpointed because we haven't saved in ages. Let's have a look at what we got here. No, we need to go upstairs. Oh, gosh, really? <sighs> go all the way back upstairs. That's such a pain. It's alright, we'll be more careful this time. Kind of regret not having the shotgun instead now. It's, it's a real downer, but it is what it is. Out of the way. This, this, um, this save, uh... careful this time. Oh, you know what? In, 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 in. We're not that far back, guys. This is not, nothing we can't handle. So it's called the Nemesis. Let's get this thing. Have you fought Nikolai yet? No, we're, we're still looking for him. We're pretty... We're not far away. This is it. Response. Oh gosh, don't die again, Rick. It's alright. I'm kind of glad that we're stockpiled our shotgun shells. So once we get out of here alive, we're going to have plenty of shotgun left. We're gonna put the shotgun back on as soon as we make it out. How are we going for the? Let's be very careful. Very careful. Oh 
gosh. Oh, there we go. Gonna use that. Can we combine these? Oh, come on! Fuckity hell! Oh, dude. I am so freaking stuck. Maybe I can outrun them. Maybe that's what I need to do. Maybe I shouldn't fight them. I am so fr- Oh, my God. I am so stuck. Oh my gosh. Do you think I should just outrun them this time? Oh man, that sucks. I don't know. Gosh, I have to go all the way back up here again. Fuck that. Man, I'm about to explode. Maybe I should go back. You know what we're going to do? We're going to go back and get the shotgun, actually. We're going to go back and we're going to get the shotgun. I know this is fucking around, but that's what we're going to do. We're going to go back and get the shotgun. Timmy dropping 100 stars. Thank you so much, Timmy. Hey, you going, Vince? Good to see you. Timmy, I'll be right with you, my man. We're going to have to come back. Those hunters, are, they are. I'm just hoping we don't have to backtrack too much. Try not, try not to get too lost either. Alright, let's have to see how far we are. Alright, here we go. The storage room's just over here. Don't feel bad you had to pee too. Yeah. Oh, here we go. We got this, guys. Taking care of it. Put that away. Put that away. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take out the shotgun and all the shells and then I'm going to pee very quickly. One last time. Where are all these shells at? Any more in here that we can see? No. All right, here we go. All right, guys, I'll be right back. So we did that. Um, all right, cool. I don't think we're gonna lose this time with the shoddy. Joshy dropping the fifty. Sorry, Timmy and both. Joshy said. Sorry, Timmy said a hundred. Joshy sent fifty. This is going for you guys. Sorry, I didn't mean to forget to send them. No, I'm saving the grenades for Nemesis. I, I ain't using, uh... Oh, sorry, I only just saw that, Curtis. <laughs> Later, bro. I, I, I'm just trying to focus here. I did wash their hands. You guys know I always wash my hands. And this game just definitely ramped it up, ramped up his uh, difficulty in the second half, didn't it? We got so many parts on this shotgun that it's going to do some uh, awesome damage. I mean, that's always a silver lining, I guess. Nemesis. 
Alright guys, we're out of here. An we ain't gonna lose this time. Curtis says, get your game on, brother. I'm, I'm getting my game on. As I said, the more we play this Resident Evil game, the easier it'll be the, the next times, because it'll all be muscle memory, you know? I'm actually kind of surprised we're not more stuck today. Just, just straight up. <laughs> some bitches. All done. Just like that, guys. Now where are we gonna go? Just up the top? <clears throat> trying to save as much ammo as I can for now. There you go guys, so we can go in this room, we can save one more time, we just make this vaccine. Fantastic. Andrew says that was easy, yeah man. Well you know, at least we know how much stronger the shotgun is over the freaking machine gun in this game now, huh? So which, which room is it? Here it is, over in the middle. Captain BS says shotgun for the women. The win, you damn straight, man. Unauthorized materials detected. Either I've got this wrong or I'm missing something. Okay, stuff. we're gonna do this one first. Hang on. Unauthorized materials okay. detected. Maybe this one first. Unauthorized materials oh, What am I missing? Detected. Oh, dude. Maybe I've got to combine both of those together. Okay, that's it. Maybe now I've got to use this. Okay. So how do we make this again? I don't know how to make this. We're going to get it in the middle range, I'm guessing. Hmm. Gosh, so Curtis says he can't help, help with this puzzle. We're gonna get it all in the mid range in the 50, I think. Alright, here we go. Another puzzle. Oh my gosh. These puzzles are kind of frustrating. Yeah, I... It's not going to work. So I don't think we're going to have high on any of them, do we? Oh, there we go. We did it. Oh, we got it. Thank you, Richard. Please remove the vaccine canister. That took long enough, didn't it? <laughs> oh, gosh. This 
escape the facility. Alright, well, I'm going to try to escape the facility. Which way are we supposed to go exactly? Oh, we're going to go in this air... Okay, no worries. Nice ass, by the way, Jill. <laughs> I, I have a funny feeling we're going to have an... Oh, crap. We're going to have another Nemesis battle soon, aren't we? Mr. X like Resident Evil 2 Remake? There is, man. The Resident Evil 2 Remake was the one before this. Oh, go, Jill, go. back here in a hurry. It's like they've just blown up Skynet. I have a feeling the reason we're in here is because we've got another boss battle coming up, so time time to buckle up, my friends. Time to buckle up. Let's just pull out the, um, what are we going to pull out? Where is it? The grenade launcher. I'm going to pull out a ton of uh, flame rounds here. And, uh, yeah, that, that, that should keep us going for a minute. Um... Save one more time. So what does the boss do in this game? Does he walk around like Mr. X? He's actually worse than Mr. X because he's really, really, like, uh... He's savage, man. He's really savage. There we go. We got plenty of this stuff. We ain't gonna run out of ammo here in a hurry. Alright, where are we gonna go? This must be the next area. What in God's name is this place? <clears throat> How you going, Cruz? Good to see you, brother. Thank you for hanging out. Hope you're having a great day. You need a samurai sword like machine gun, you think so? I mean, hopefully that'd help us out. I mean, whatever. I'm, I'm willing to take anything these days. So, so yeah, Vince says Nemesis basically makes Mr. X look like Mr. Rogers. How you going, by the way, True Vet? Good to see you. Sorry, I missed ya. We got Gerald in here. How am I finding the game so far? I love it, man. Like, the second half of this game has been a little bit tedious, but the first half was just amazing. O overall, I think this is fantastic. Now I know you can't put a price on life. But I'm in this business to get paid. So let's make a deal. So Eric says, is this kind of open world in a Metroid vein? Yeah, I mean, yeah, I mean, you've got to walk around it. I mean, it's... I mean, you've got to... You can walk... I mean, I don't know. How do I explain it? I mean, it's just that the world's like any normal Resident Evil game. I mean, if you've played a Resident Evil game, expect the same kind of thing. Oh, surprise. Aren't they? It's not a hard boss battle. Is he dead? Not yet. It's gonna be. He's not too far off. There you go. That's what happens when you save all your good ammo for the end. It becomes a lot easier. <laughs> oh, 
it's not over yet. Part will do. Oh wait, there's zombies down here as well. No one told me that in the program. Oh gosh. Okay, Jill, might might be time for you now, sweetheart, to you know maybe have some herb. Oh gosh. Oh my gosh. Come on, get him. Might might be time to go back to the shotgun for a second. Let's go back to this gun. Where is he? Come out and play, shitbird. Which tank is he behind? Do you know which tank he's behind? Number, Number six. six, there you go. Oh crap! Come on, die. Is he dead? Oh, he's still going. Die! Oh my gosh. Now which one's he behind? I keep an eye on him. Here comes some more. Number, six. number six? Where's number six at? Come on. I got this. You got this cult? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Is he dead yet? Not what I intended to hit. Well, I'll take it. Oh, he's still alive, dude! Oh my gosh, this is nuts. Okay, this isn't as easy. Barkadoo! Oh my gosh. Is he dead? Oh, he's still going. Bro! How are we going for health? We're still on fine. Alright, good. Oh, nuts. <laughs> this isn't crazy. How'd you already get this mark? I live in Australia. Everyone asks me that question. My, my, my. I'm not doing anything special, guys. I'm just happy to. For, I'm just fortunate enough to live in Australia, and we we get it a day early because it's already the third over here. So there's there's no secret, no conspiracy theory, nothing like that. I wish I could say I'm really special, but I'm not. Here comes a crate. <laughs> Use it to climb up. Oh, no. oh, dude! Come on. Come on. Oh, nice. <laughs> well, we've still got plenty of grenade rounds left if we have to take him on again, which I'm sure we will. So glad we're out of here now. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Oh, they're dropping acid on everything? Oh, come on, that's gotta be it. See you later, that's gotta be it, surely. Mark says you move into Aussie, can you bunk with me? Oh, bro, I don't have any bedrooms left. I mean, there's a couch here, I guess. Actually, we don't even have a couch in here right now. I'll get a couch. <laughs> I pretty much just live in my bedroom. I don't really have the living room set up like a living room. I have to get that vaccine back. Oh boy. What an intense battle. That was actually a lot of fun, let me tell ya. Are we gonna put that grenade uh, gun away for now? Um, where, where's this uh, gunpowder? Alright, here we go. We're gonna take that out. You know what we're gonna do? We're also gonna bring in. Um, I'm not gonna use the handgun anymore. I am gonna use. Uh, what are we gonna use? 
assault rifle, maybe uh... yeah, wait, how many other shells have we got? Let me just double check this. Um, that'll do. And what else have we got? There we go, save from here. There you go, we're good to go. How you going, Chris? Good to see you're on your way. You're gonna come hang out? Or oh, you know what? I'm, I'm not. Hang on, did I did I press though? So... I always, always worry I don't save it properly. That's how paranoid I'm getting right now. now we got plenty of gunpowder. We don't need that right now. All right, so let's see what's in here. Which way are we gonna go? Staff break room. So there's all these doors that we haven't been in here over here. And this... Okay, this is it. Okay. <laughs> Guys, please don't forget to smash that like button if you haven't yet. Big thank you in advance. It's done. Give me the vaccine, you greedy son of a bitch. No, 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 no. You, Prince Mother. I like her. We shall make ours an ongoing arrangement. Now drop the gun! Oh, are you kidding me? Have you... Have you ever seen anything so incredible? Oh gosh. The data on this would be worth millions. But... Oh, Chris, good to uh, see you, man. You know how it is. City's about to explode. And you can't put a price on life. <laughs> good luck! Damn, another Nikolai! boss. Joe! Go after Nikolai. He's got the vaccine. What about you? We're running out of time. Well, I'm gonna do the best to beat it with the weapons I got, but I, I didn't realize I had another boss battle already. Look, just so you know, this is the last Dude, fucking Dude, this time. is crazy. Oh my gosh. All right. gonna work. Alright, let's try that. Nothing's phasing it. So what, what are we gonna do then? What's this? Oh, we're gonna use this big gigantic gun. Alright. This is like the ending of Resident Evil, um... Like the end of Resident Evil. So maybe we don't have the clock tower in this one. We didn't do anything at the clock tower. Damn, it needs power. So we gotta go to okay, I see. Maybe this is the end. Alright, so we got this. It's alright, we got plenty of health light full buckety. Come on, how are we going for health? Caution, there you go. We're going to use that. We might we might need to stop... Oh, crap. There we go. Let's go back over here. Put the power on, Jill. Come on. There we go. Oh, come on, we can do this. Come on, Jill. Oh, that's another one. Come on, get out of there. Shit, bro. Oh, this is freaking nuts. This is, oh, gosh. All right, come on. Oh, my gosh. Get out of there, Jill. Oh, my gosh. Come on, Jill, sandwich. You can do it. Oh, damn it, damn it, damn it, let me go! Let me go! Oh my gosh. Holy shit. 
You have, you have to be very... Oh my gosh. Oh man, all right, we're gonna have to go back to this chest. That's fine Man, that is nuts Well, it was like a one-hit death Well, what might it might prevent him from hitting me when I go to the palace light hit, hit the beating meat behind him you think? All right, let's just go in here. We're gonna we're gonna get some more stuff out We're gonna put this machine gun away and instead, we're going to take out a ton of health and a ton of freaking grenades, let me tell ya. We'll take that out. Um, we're going to take... What, where, where are the grenade rounds at? Explosive rounds. Mine rounds. Just all this shit. Like, everything we got. And explosive rounds. And, uh, where are all these health... First aid spray... My gosh, seriously. <laughs> Alright, we'll, we'll get it this time. Alright, so I'm gonna I'm gonna take your advice. This is all saved, we're all prepared. The end of the game is picking up the pace again. It is, isn't it? How you going, Timmy? Good to see you still in here. <coughs> well, let's do this again. So we'll skip the cutscene, we won't do it this time. I'll try and be more careful this time. It's done. Give me the vaccine, you greedy son of a bitch. No, 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 no. You print money. I like money. We shall make ours an ongoing arrangement. Now drop the gun! Can we press the skip? Here we go, we did that already. I like that cutscene, but here we go. Alright, defeat the creature. Okay, oh my gosh. Go back to that other power source. No, he doesn't, Ryan. Good question, but no, that doesn't happen. They've got two separate inventory boxes. Alright, so we're gonna go over here again. You said shoot that thing there, right? Alright, get out of there, Jill. Oh crap, that was close. Where'd you say the other thing was? It's like over here. It's like that little heart thing. What does that little heartbeat thing do? Hang on. So don't worry, he just drops in me. Okay, here we go. That, that, that was the hardest one to do, so I'm glad that's over with. Alright, so they, he's gonna like regenerate. I thought as much. Alright, there we go. So we're gonna use, um... I'm just gonna be very overly cautious here. We're gonna be fine. So, we're gonna just quickly, um... Okay, so we'll get that. That's fine. That's all done. Get this one. So, okay, I see the tactic now. Easy. Easy peasy, as my friend Asuka would say. There you go, that's it. Fantastic. Just put this one last one in. Fuck yeah. Oh my gosh, okay, may maybe be a little bit more careful, Jill, but that's alright. Oh my gosh. Now, this is not too hard. This is a pretty straightforward pattern. Yeah, thank you, Renan. So, Curtis says just do this at your pace. Oh, it's all right. We're gonna. So what? We're, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna shoot. I think what I need to do is I need to shoot the cancers and then pick up this uh, big gigantic gun. So I'm gonna shoot the cancers here and then I'll pick up the electric cannon. That, that's gonna be my plan of attack.
Is that it? I think that's it. I think we got it. So let's pick up this big sunbish gun. I think we got him. I think this is it, guys. Hopefully, hopefully this is going to be enough, eh? Hey? Is that it? Oh my gosh. And so we're just going to put it in his mouth now? Oh yeah. Okay. Come on. Next time, take the fucking hit. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, delicious. That's that's freaking sweet. Oh man, that was so cool. I think that's it. I think the nemesis is... Take back the vaccine. Okay. I think nemesis is finally dead here, boys and girls. Jeez. You did want to hope so, huh? So, so how do I get out of here? That's a question. Oh, there's a ladder in the back. Okay, I think there's some ammo in here before we go. Uh, at this point, the care factor is about zero. Is there any ammo over here? Hang on. I don't care about their handgun ammo at this point. Okay, let's just take the assault rifle ammo. Um, so we're going to go back down here to this ladder, apparently. All right. Oh, gosh. No, Carlos doesn't have a lockpick. You can only use the lockpick with Claire in this. Thank you, Tristan. Okay, so far so good. <coughs> Curtis says Nemesis don't die to the end. This looks pretty... I mean, he looks like he's dead. I mean, unless he's like the liquid metal man in Terminator, I'm pretty sure he's dead. I'm pretty sure he's dead. I mean, how, how, how much else do we need to do to him? That sucks. You're not going to stop. Promised you this, didn't you? Oh no. Do you have any idea what you've just done? No, no. Don't care. My client ordered me to reduce umbrella to rub. Ten minutes until missile ah. impact. The missile has launched. And that is my cue. Goodbye, Miss Valentine. Shame you didn't listen to me when you had the chance. I'm glad you enjoyed it, Ryan, man. This is awesome. It's you! Shoot him! I can't! I'll hit you! Do it! You have to! There's no other way! Carlos! Hey! When I told you I couldn't leave you in a Carlos's world, that would just be too cruel. Oh, gosh. You might want to finish him off. Why'd you do it? There's a price tag for everything. Even letting the world burn. <clears throat> Who are you working for? I'll tell you. If you get me out of here. I'll pay you whatever you want. You're a fool. You're a fool! If I die, you'll never find out the truth. I don't mind a little detective work. Maybe this is the end. It's just, I wasn't sure because this is structured a little bit different to the original number three, but it certainly feels like the end. Joe, you all right?
right. There he is. Oh, there you go. Raccoon City's now getting destroyed. Goodbye, Raccoon City. to it, doesn't it? No, no worries, Dex. My pleasure. Thank you for supporting today. I'm just so glad that, because I got really, really stuck with the Resident Evil 2 remake. I'm just glad we managed to beat this one, but I think I'm going to go back and practice the old one after this and, and hopefully come back on with it. I felt empty and cold as the heat from the blast washed over us. All of this death wasn't caused by a monster making a virus, it was greed. Human grade. I decided then and there, the ashes of Rackham I think this is the end, Jason. So it looks like about five hours. Although I, I was a little bit quicker today because the, I, I was about a half an hour quicker today than yesterday. Wow. There we go. We just beat it, huh? Oh, oh as I said, I was a half an hour quicker today. Um, because, uh, let me just go back here. Yeah, I was half an hour quicker today because we practiced uh, early this morning. There you go. Wow, that is incredible. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I may as well ask you, well, what'd you all think? What'd you guys all think today? Team says, great job. Thank you so much, Captain BS. Appreciate you. The only, the only thing I was really disappointed with is we didn't get the clock tower in this like we did in the other one. And, uh, Thomas, thank you for the 50 stars. Josh with the 50. Timmy with the 200. Thank you, guys. I'm going to give the big star screen. This one's going out to you. I'll do a couple here before we go. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Maddie with the 50 stars. Thank you. So it was a little bit short, um, but which kind of makes sense because we got this, if you think about it guys, we got this game only a year after the Resident Evil 2 remake, so I think there's only so much you can do in a year. But don't forget this game also comes with an online multiplayer mode, which might be worth checking out. So I might practice that offline behind the scenes and uh, see if that's worthwhile to you guys. Russell says he's going to get ASAP. Uh, next time, I'll play through this again for you guys in a few weeks. And once I'm feeling more comfortable, I'll do the, the harder difficulties as well. And, um, yeah, wow, man, that's incredible. Don't, don't forget to tell everyone you know who wants to watch about this gameplay, hey? Because we're one of the first in our community to finish it. It'll be pretty cool. They can get a quick sneak peek. Now you know what to expect. Next play will be stronger exactly. The hospital was definitely the hardest bit for me. Honestly, the only bit of this game I didn't enjoy was the hospital. But apart from that, no problem. It's a, it's a player versus player, Joshy. But guys, thank you so much for coming in. We may as well go back to the full screen in here now. That was Resident Evil 3 from start to finish. And uh, a big thank you for your help. Thank you for your support. Guys, before we all leave, uh, if you're going to bed, first of all, have a great sleep. Uh, but for everyone else, uh, we're going to see if there's anyone else online here. So, apparently there's no one else online. Hang on, let's have a look. For some reason it's saying there's no one else on. Let me have a look here. Oh, let's have a look. Search for streamer Eric. For some, for some reason it's not letting me send you guys to another stream. Let's have a look. Okay, here we go. We got our friend, good friend Eric Busby currently streaming now, so everyone pop in and say hello. Um, but there we go, just sorting that out. Once again, guys, thank you so much for coming. Have a great sleep. Don't forget, if you get up early enough, guys, we're going to be back on at 9 a.m. Eastern. Don't know what I'm going to play uh, yet, but um, do I think Nikolai survived? Oh, 
Oh, wait, Alejandro, I think, is on the... Anyway, sorry, guys. I'm all over the place. I need to get some rest. All right. We'll see you again later on, guys. You all take care. Thank you for today.